Hello. Welcome. Welcome to me. <laughs> Welcome to you. Welcome to everybody. And welcome to Crazy Conveyor Belt <laughs> Mayhem. We're uh, we're back, back in Factory Town. I I can't get enough of this game. <laughs> I'm just like, oh, how many hours have I been playing this for? I don't know. Let's see, what does Steam say? Oh, not that many. Only 36 hours. Rookie numbers. We can get that. <laughs> we can get those numbers up. I think uh, I'll probably I'll probably have to stop playing this game on stream so much. I feel like stream <laughs> the stream uh, benefits from variety, right? So if we just like <laughs> if we're only ever playing this game, people get sick of that, surely. I mean, I'll never get sick of this game. Eventually, I'll get sick of this game. Maybe. I don't know how long it will take though. Shows no signs of happening anytime soon, man. I love that. I love that whole, this whole town. What a beautiful town. God, though, I, I don't remember what I was doing. <laughs> uh, town center is level five. We need antidotes and blue points to make it a higher level. I assume we want to do that. We need to get it up to level seven. We need a magic forge. We need mana purification. What do we need for that? No oh, mage tower. Oh, mana transmission. Advanced medicine. Okay, we got some cool stuff ahead of us. Caravan. I mean, we could always like build a road out to one of these trade posts. What are all the trade posts about? I don't remember, of course. <laughs> Gold to wool, bread to, bread to cakes could be interesting, because we're making bread, right? What do cakes do for us? 50 coins at the tavern. So we like double, double the value of the coins. Three apples for a bread. I guess that about doubles your, your coin yield, but I don't, I don't know about that one. Although, if we are swapping breads, Breads for apple. Breads for apples. You know what we could do? Is this the one? Yeah, this is the one. We could just start an apple farm right next to this place. Grow a bunch of apples here. And uh, trade the apples for bread. Then pump the bread straight back in to trade the bread for cakes. So this could just be like a cake factory. And then we just ship the cakes into town. Also, we need a uh, we need a tavern. We need a tavern that's in range of all our houses. So I guess over here somewhere, maybe. This seems like a reasonable spot for it. How are we doing on? Oh, beautiful, plenty of bricks. Um. No, that's not. Yeah, that's that's where we want them. It's a little bit like yeah. <laughs> Got this little bit of grass in there, but whatever. Whatever. We got a. That's not the one. We got to put some of this down there too. Oh, fine. <laughs> there. That's all good. Yeah. I was um I was planning to put more houses over this way, wasn't I? So where's my uh I guess Hmm. So the school is the one whose range is gonna most uh most likely limit us. And the range on that's or or <laughs> it's alright. <laughs> How about this guy? Uh, I was thinking over here as well, but the, uh, the food market doesn't reach over there. 
general store is fine. I could always have like houses on stilts up here. <laughs> Maybe it would make sense to just like from a gameplay perspective, I think it would be good to have just like houses stacked on top of each other here with like some kind of stupid road like staking up to <laughs> to meet them. But I just think it would look so stupid that I don't want to do it. I think additional houses will go on this platform here. So let's like get a sign. Let's put it like this. House zone, call it. Future residential. There we go. Now when we when I'm looking for a place to put stuff, I won't put stuff here on this platform. So how many houses can we put on here? One, two, three. We can fit three in. Three is a reasonable amount, I guess. I mean, we're not even using that much of our population, so I feel like we don't we don't need to be in any rush to put down any more houses. Just good to know where they're gonna be. Tab down. Tab downer. And you know what? The tavern would go so well here, though. <laughs> we could always move the tavern in the future. Oh, look, the tavern doesn't cover all the houses if I put it there. I need to put it, like, here. And then it just covers these end houses. There's nowhere better to put it, is there? Alright. Oh, God. I've revealed the, uh... <laughs> the wooden... The wooden struts below. There we go. Now you can't see. You can't see that it's all wood and horrible down there. Here we go, a nice tavern. This will be able to... Yeah, this will be able to supply all the houses. We're gonna need it one way or another, so... Good to get it put down. And I suppose I want some kind of, like... Path leading out here. How? We need some kind of like, I don't know, some kind of like road leading up here. The crazy bridge over over here. The pear? Pear trees? I don't think we care about pears. Even though caring about pears does rhyme. We need more bricks in storage. Where's our brick storage? Here. Can Oh, is this barn already fully upgraded? Really? Damn. Well, uh... That's alright. <laughs> We're generating... Oh no, what have I done? <laughs> We're generating industrial research points. Oh uh, yeah, we're trying to save up for deep mining, so that we can uh, put our put our iron mine back here. Since there's like we go in the the mining layer, there's all this like stuff down here, but we don't have the deep mining to to get to it. Right, so that's 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 ticking away. We're just low on books. Why are we low on books? Paper's not coming in fast enough? Really? I guess because we need four bits of paper per thing. Per book. Okay, well... Let's do something like this. I'm gonna get rid of that litter there. So that all of these are going... Paper, 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 paper. Hmm. Okay, we're not like pulling the paper out fast enough. <laughs> it's gonna be difficult to get the paper in, uh, in there. 
I think I'm gonna have to like rearrange these silly plat platforms, these silly like uh, conveyor belts here. This guy will just have to like stay up for longer or something like this. This coal conveyor belt is the worst. I think this coal conveyor belt needs to like okay. We're gonna we're gonna have some some big changes to this coal conveyor belt here. It's really in the way of getting paper out. It's gonna be a bit of a pain. gonna be a huge pain getting it all removed. Maybe I should just be... If I'm gonna do all this I should just fix this this one here as well at the same time. I think this should just go down this way instead of doing this like extra snaking up here. I like manually delete all this. <laughs> Come on. Because I, I, I can't do the, like the select, the select all thing, select whole column thing because uh, we got, we got like stuff under it which would get selected. And get wrecked by 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 me doing that. Actually, I can I can do the select column for these ones. Select and just like delete everything in that column. I don't think I can do it for these. Uh, I could do it for these ones. I think. There we go. And maybe these ones. Yeah. Oh, maybe I shouldn't have deleted that whole column. Ah, it's fine. Easily fixed. There we go. Ow. You still grab paper, good. Paper can go in there. Delete this grabber. Um, I'll leave that because I'm not sure. I think the coal will probably still go over this way, but uh, certainly the conveyor belts won't. You know what? I'm I, I'm just gonna delete the coal conveyor belt, even though it might it might end up being in the same spot in the future. Okay, that pit can stay. Let's do the coal one first. Will it go through here? Yeah, it'll go through this way. But it's gonna go like up higher. Maybe. Let's let's make We'll, we'll leave room for like more of this stuff too, but I want to like have at least a second thing grabbing paper out of here. And hopefully that can keep up with uh, how much paper we need for making books. So we're not really stockpiling any paper, but we are, you know, we've got plenty in the output here. We've got like wood feeding in, we've got water feeding in. It should be, it should be fine. Oh yeah, we want to get fertilizer from over here. The fertilizer, like, would have to come, like, up over here, and we've got this stupid, like, crazy, uh, crazy mess of conveyor belts here. Like, oh, remember this <laughs> Remember this one? This was what I built at, like, the end of last stream. I'm, like, rushing to <laughs> get it finished. It seems to work. 
Like these cloaks will be like these cloaks will be making us tons of cash. Look at that, 20 red each. Although we're hardly producing any cloaks. Why is that? We're not getting enough cloth in. There's no cloth in here. This guy's got no cloth. This guy's not getting any wool, that's why. I guess this just needs more workers. There, cool. cool. We'll just fill that up with workers. We got plenty of pop to spare. That doesn't really it doesn't cost us anything to put workers in there. Well, I suppose technically it costs us something, but it doesn't cost us anything that we don't already have tons of. Bum, bo, bo, bo. Oops. So I'm thinking like get up get up high straight away with this. We gotta, we gotta get real high. Scream at the top of our lungs. What's going on? I think uh, I think we'll just come over this building and we'll we'll bring the bring the coal on top of the uh, on top of the water here. means all of that doesn't need to be there. Bum, 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 bum. Okay, so we need to get it up to that height. Which is like that. Not really too high. Yeah, I think I've like somehow managed to do it perfectly. Just magic. Actually, if we can start going down there, that's like the uh, the pro gamer move, and we're like, oh, huh. I wonder if we want to have this like one higher so there can be another layer. In <laughs> Let's not overcomplicate this thing. Let's just uh, do it in a way that will work. Bam, bam, bam. Da da da, da da, bam. Here we go. Now Cole can get in there. The conveyor belts, though. How many of these have we got? 300 something, that's that's okay. I remember we were having like trouble with them, but I guess we're not now. So these are gonna go... Through here? <laughs> I wonder if they can go like under there. They can, right? It's like perfect. I think we'll need to delete that. No, we can't. It might not be able to go. Oh. Can a conveyor belt go in there? Will stuff travel on it? Find out in the next episode of What Am I Doing? How did I get here? What the hell is going on? Maybe. Maybe is the answer. Maybe is always the answer. I mean, that's lined up with that. If it can't get under there, I think it will be able to. Yeah, it can. Sweet. 
So now we just go down here, just like over these trees. Suppose this one is a bit where we can actually have a thing. Then we're gonna have to. Oh. Okay, I see. Well, we're gonna have to, like, go at a higher height here. The highest of all heights. Um, I'm gonna do it like this, actually. Blam, blam. And then down. Down the first chance we get. Luckily, there's no trees in this particular spot here, so... That lets me make that look a bit better. <laughs> if it's somewhat supported. It can't be supported there because of the slope as well, so... And we won't be able to have it supported over the trees. But I think I do need it to be going downhill over the trees, so... A bit awkward. If we like, that works. Just have this like big floating thing here. I think this thing might end up having to come in at a slightly higher height. No, maybe not. In fact, definitely not. That's like perfect. Just goes straight down here. There's a little like hump in the middle, but I don't think we can avoid that, can we? Um, we could avoid that. I think it looks fine. Maybe it would look better if... Yeah, we we can get rid of the hump. Do this. This will look a lot, a lot nicer. Much better. No weird hump. We do have a weird hump here, but... That, that one's unavoidable. It needs to go over the, uh, the water conveyor belt. Wait, is this water conveyor belt still working? Yes. How many of these have we got left? 250? I kind of want to get this whole thing done. <laughs> I wasn't sure I'd be able to... Wait. Come on. There we go. I feel like since half of the conveyor belt is metal, I want the whole thing to be metal. Hang on a second. There we go. Sorted. I think our metal woes... Yeah, our metal woes are over, right? Look at all that metal! Brilliant. Let's upgrade this, get even more metal in there. We have, we have the technology. just got kind of like backlogs of all this stuff so that's a good thing <laughs> means we're producing more than we're using although how has this affected like our, our paper production or our paper extraction now we need more workers in here we probably need to start making these steam pipes so that we can begin adding steam boosters to some of our important buildings. Like, this one's already right next to a, a water conveyor belt, so... it might be a good place to add... add some steam. Steamy steam. Not sure. Not really sure exactly what we're gonna do with all that. We'll figure it out. <laughs> steam. Oh wait, we want uh, deep mining first. We've got the steam research, I'm pretty sure. 
Right. Steam. Yes, we do. Steam pipes are made in the forge. So we need another another forge. Ooh. <laughs> Where's our current forge? Up here somewhere? Is that it? That's it. So we got two forges next to each other here. I mean, we've got this, like, convey about taking metal along there. Oh, the forge needs to take in the uh, metal balls, so the balls of steel. <laughs> With their iron, not steel. Uh, forge. Hmm, where could this go? Oh, it's also going to need to take in some coal. Get upgraded. Get upgraded. Get upgraded. Get upgraded. We don't need, like, crappy cloth conveyor belts around the place anymore. Let's upgrade them all. Let's see. The power. The iron conveyor belts. Metal conveyor belts. I mean, this one doesn't really matter, does it? It's not like it's, uh... It's not like it's getting full. Getting full? Yeah, that's the thing. It's it's not like we're producing enough for the limitations to matter on that one. Come on. Yeah, nice. We probably need to get this one upgraded. Well, I already half upgraded it. I must have run out of metal conveyor belts when I was doing that. Now we've got like 200 of them. Brilliant. How's this going now? It's not getting enough water. Well, it doesn't have a conveyor belt bringing water into it. We can fix that. We just stick a well right here. Perfect. Now it should be getting more water. Hopefully enough. Yeah, it's filling up. Now it needs to be getting more uh, more animal feed. We probably... This will be one which we really want to get a steam booster on. And the amount of... The amount of, like... <laughs> grain balls that are coming out of here. It's beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. We might eventually... Like, we've got a straight run from here to there, so we might eventually get an even more efficient farm, because this farm isn't quite able to use all of the space around it. If we could get a farm up here, which is on perfectly flat ground, using all the space around it, we could be exporting even more wheat balls. So I suppose I could just have multiple farms. I don't know, I like having just like one building. Just like a super building. Rather than having to like... Have a whole bunch of buildings. I don't know why I feel that way, but I do. What other barns have we got that need upgrading? That one doesn't. Um, this one? No. Nope. This one? Uh, sure, we could use more, more planks in storage. This one, more coal, more logs. We could use that. Where's this guy getting logs from? Nowhere. How is he full of logs? <laughs> I guess we could uh, bring lo these logs in. But those are meant to be going into the paper mill. This guy's not outputting enough for both of these mills. Why is he not? He seems to be outputting a lot. <laughs> it might just be a problem of it not having enough trees around it. But it does no, it's got plenty of full grown trees. It's just not it's not chopping them down fast enough. Maybe? We could use, we could take back some of these spots here for more trees. 
Yeah. Let's, uh, tree. Tree planter. Plant tree There we go. Three extra trees. I suppose we need a yellow point booster on this to get him outputting faster. Because we got... Yeah, it's outputting... Oh. It's outputting from three things at once, so... We need to be producing three a second, at least. Probably more than that. Now it's producing four a second. This, we're still not getting... Oh, now we're kind of getting enough input in there. We're not getting enough input in this one, though. So we need even more coin boosting. How about now? Input going up. Input going up. Okay. If the input is starting to go up, that means we have slightly too many. How about now? Is it going up? It's still... Still seems to be going up very slowly. This is probably about as good as we can get it. Actually, we should just put in two and focus on getting the happiness up. Why is our happiness so shit? We need to get these people more, like, jam and stuff. Things which will make them really happy. Uh... They need, like, medicine, gourmet food. They need regular food as well. Are we not getting them regular food? What happened to fish? Why are we not producing any fish? Okay, well that has got to change. Let's get this guy in here. And let's build a fishery. We'll build a fishery, like, out here. Just, like, on... <laughs> on stilts out here somewhere. Let's, uh, let's stick him up here for now. I think we want to build it. Well, it's next to all water. Um, I think we just want like a jetty sticking out, and we'll stick him out here. But I'm, I'm just gonna stick him like uh, somewhere, <laughs> just over here for now. And we'll we'll make the space where it's gonna go. Then we'll build it. Um. Is that right? That is right. It's a three out, and it's a three by three building. I guess we need a bit of road on it, even though it looks a little bit dumb. Just so that our our friends the the wagons can get up, get to it easily if they need to. Because who knows, we might need to deliver fish to some like far off land. I suppose if we can do that, I will do this. Make it so it's ooh, 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 ooh. Cheese and whiskers. <laughs> okay, there we go. And... Uh... Like that. Yeah! Beautiful. Now we, you know, we've got our, like, stone path for the wagons and we got the nice looking wood paths. And you make fish. There's only one recipe available, just do that one. And make tons of it. We need more. And then we'll just like ship it into the the barn, yeah. Seems like the best way to go about that. Bum, 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 bum. We leave a bit of space down there so Ships can still go under it. There we go. Fish is outputting faster than it's being generated, very, very slightly. 
which means we're probably good on that. We're going to have to turn this into a metal conveyor belt too. Perfect. Oh, I like this one. It's just like, doesn't do any crazy winding like this thing. <laughs> How are we doing on... We're still low on wool. Just because we're not getting enough of this in. Hmm. Our input is full on this though. Well, bullish. It could be fuller. I think we would have to go like over here. Because I need this one open to pump more <laughs> more green out of there into here. Mm. Hey look at that. Happiness is already up to 58. That's probably from like the fish deliveries getting in. Yeah, look. Starting to get fish coming in here and generating a whole bunch of gold off the fish. How much do we get per cooked fish? Not that much. This isn't even cooked fish. We only get two gold per fish. If we cook it, we get twice as much. So let's let's do that. <laughs> let's add like a kitchen over here somewhere to cook it on its way. Or we could add a kitchen down here. Makes sense. Cook it near the source so it's not like traveling raw across this conveyor belt all the way along. Like, all the way across the city. Okay, that's nice. Put our kitchen right here. Bum, 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 bum. No, why? Why did you do that? Why game? Why are you putting it floating? There we go. It's not the game's fault. It's my fault. <laughs> I clicked in the wrong spot. But I'm gonna blame the game anyway. Because the game is inanimate and it can't defend itself. We want cooked fish. We are going to need to bring the coal down here. I think that's going to have. We're going to need coal down here anyway to power our uh, our steam powered stuff. So let's just grab it here. Split it off from here. Could split here and like yeah, go over that way. Although hmm. I don't want to have too much stuff going around the tavern because the tavern needs to have stuff input into it. So maybe we'll go on like a more of a roundabout, like we'll <laughs> go all the way around like this. Even though it's gonna look silly right now that it's going such a long way around. It is for a good reason. Um, I guess we'll go around. <laughs> we'll go around the farm instead of over it. Just because it looks a little bit stupid if you go over it. Whoop. Let's just get rid of these. We only want wheat growing in the farm. Not in like random places near the farm. Ugh, ridiculous. <laughs> we can go down. Just have this come like at a lower level. Doesn't need to be all super high up. And we can also do that. We're gonna need to like go in and place these one by one. But, you know. Get a get a road going along too. Always nice. Lovely. Hook that up here. Hook this up here. There'll be something else in here, I guess. But who knows what? 
Not me. But we put this at the lowest height. It allows that road to still be accessible. And put that like that. Is this going to line up with the kitchen? No, but it will. It's just like, just bring the road out further. Might as well just like road up this whole area. <laughs> I can, it's easier to delete roads later when I want to put buildings down than it is to like not have the roads here. It's good to make make some platforms. Here we go. This lines up with this perfectly. Um, we don't need we don't need all that in there. That can just be wood arches, and the bits which are going to have buildings on them can get turned into nice nice stone. But we don't need to waste all our stone <laughs> unnecessarily. There we go. Big big old ramp up. So that goes to like there. Um, I think I'll bring the coal in on this side so I can pump fish out easier and also because the coal will probably want to branch off this way somehow. I think we just want to start going down there. Oops. Yeah, we'll, we'll have it come down straight after the cliff. I'm not sure exactly how low I want it to go. I don't think it can go in at that height, actually. It's going to need to go one lower. Then it can go in? Yeah. Perfect. So, boom, 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 boom. Perfect. That. Splitter. I like I like this better like this. The splitters, you know, I don't know, it make just looks better to me. It, it's going that way and the splitter splits it off instead of like having this one be broken in half by one going that way. If you uh understand at all what I'm <laughs> I'm saying there. Output is full on this. Output's full on that. This guy's not getting enough. Is that not going in? It wasn't going in. <laughs> well, that's why our output was full on these. How long have we not been producing any bread for? Mm. We're going to need to get the fish up to that level. The cooked fish, that is. So this conveyor belt will instead lead in here. So let's, uh, let's try not to get too much fish on it in our inventory. There we go. We gotta wait till the people are no longer sick of fish. They can only handle so much fish. Do, 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 do. 
I don't think any of this really needs to be like this. Great. I should have just done this a long time ago. And by a long time ago, I mean a few seconds ago. <laughs> a few seconds is a long time on some scales. Like, if we're talking about, like, uh, I know, nu nuclear decays and stuff, it can be a long time. Actually, not so much with nuclear decays. <laughs> Maybe with, like, uh, if we're talking about, like, the decays of um, some exotic particles and stuff. Like, muon decays and things? Oh, mu muon oscillation, I suppose it would be, wouldn't it? No, that's, uh, that's neutrinos that oscillate. <laughs> I know stuff. <laughs> I, I have a vague, a vague concept of some things. Yeah, that's good. Perfect. We should already have fish getting cooked in here now. We have to put some extra workers in because we we want to be like pumping that fish out. Bump it up. Bum 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 ba da bum bum. Bum bum. Oh yeah. The great fish escalator. Oh. Wow, that's that is so perfect. <laughs> Very satisfying. Um, there, we'll put five workers in, and we get five work units a second, which means one cooked fish a second. It does mean that we're probably, like, got too many workers in here. We only need to be making one fish a second. Let's fully upgrade this guy. Fill him up with fish. Yeah. 500 fish in this warehouse. Just stinking up the place. I like this big, big platform we've got going on here. Wait, what? Oh, there's a, uh, there's a tree in the way. Damn you, nature. Nature won't get in the way of our straight lines. <laughs> we'll make it pay for st standing in our way. And this is such a goddamn mess in here. Why are they... These are backed up because we're low on gears. And we're... We're low on gears? Why? Oh, just because we don't have enough workers in here making them. We need 10 work units per gear. I suppose we don't need to be making these at a really fast rate. It's not like we need that many of these uh, conveyor belts in storage. Let's, let's just put four guys in there. Oh, fine. We'll put, we'll put five guys in. We've got... Got like 50 guys that we're not using, so might as well. How are we doing on that research? We're up to 630 out of the 1.5k. Um, I guess I could unlock these industrial tome level 2s. And those would let me get the research faster. It uses a very... Like, it uses a tiny amount of research to get unlock it, and then... What do we need to make those? Wheels and steam pipes. Well, we need to make the steam pipes anyway. We've got the wheel factory here. We're storing wheels in here. Okay. Okay, I guess 
that means we do need to start upgrading this guy. We are going to need to start having uh, pickaxes in storage too. Let's just upgrade this guy all the way. <laughs> Man, so uh, our wagon parking lot. Let's let's put all the wagons over here now. Over in that corner. <laughs> this corner is starting to have stuff done in it, so... No wagons there anymore. So steam pipes. Man, I was... I was looking at making steam pipes like ages ago. <laughs> I was looking where I could place this and then I get distracted with other things, didn't I? Mm -hmm. Steam pipes could also go in here. Which means we just need to be getting this stuff into the uh into the uh, I feel like we make like we're not using nails that quickly. So we could probably split off of this guy. Oh, but... Hmm. Okay, this guy has its own, and it's splitting off there. Because we want all of the plates. Yeah, it seems to be going alright. So we'll split off of here. Maybe like... It, maybe at this point. And then we can go up and over here. But we'd have to go over that as well. <laughs> Ooh. Tight. It's tight around here. Maybe we can split off of this one. Or just like just make a a new a new way of pulling it out. I'm looking around for like where it might not be terrible. Okay. Oh this is in the range. Put him here. Or I might even do something a bit crazy and raise it up to make it easier to get. Oh, actually, yeah, yeah, because that then we won't have to lower it as much because we're going to have to go over all this stuff. What if I like? Raise him up by... That looks too dumb, having it raised up on that. <laughs> it looks pretty dumb. Maybe it will look less dumb once I add some, like, stairs. Waste a little bit of space having having a staircase here. But that's fine. Maybe, maybe we won't raise it up quite so much. We we'll only raise it up that much. Then it won't look as stupid. We're like this with a ramp in the middle. <laughs> so wagons can still get up here. Sorry, trees. You're gone. You're out of here. We're gonna have to. Wow. You can barely see it, but from this angle you can see those bricks that I just put in. And I like that. Um, we are going to have to put the... Oh, I see. That's much more uneven than I thought it was. Like, why is, <laughs> why is it looking like that? We're going to need to cut all this grass to be able to see what's going on around here. There we go. That's that's what's going on. It's a big mess. The mine will have to go in here somewhere. Uh, wait, the mine is just a building. Probably like there. There. Yeah, the mine will go, like, here. Right here. So let's clear clear the spot where the mine will go. I'm pretty sure that needs to go on terrain. Oh man, we have to, like, go all the way down there with all these blocks just to get that little corner done. Boom, 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 boom. 
Um, hmm. I think we'll come out one more here. Bada boop. 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 But over this bit will just be a little woody bit. A, li a little woody. <laughs> Who doesn't love a little woody? <laughs> always. Always good. Yeah, we don't need to worry too much about out here because I think it's outside the range of the town. Boom, boom, boom. Just gonna beautify it up a little bit. Add some of these uh, wooden platforms. But I am. Maybe there'll even be a bridge here. I won't. Uh, I won't finish up the wooden platforms here, just because they might. They may, might end up being a bridge. So there's like nice flat land around here. Which could be good for building on. And there's all these mana shards. Could be good to like have uh, like mana town over here or something. But we got pear trees, tomatoes, bunch of uh, trees, herbs. Herbs are good. We need herbs for uh, medicine. And sugar. Sugar's good for jam. Oh, we going on fish. Full of fish. <laughs> we got tons of fish. Our fish conveyor belts are all clogged, which is great because that means all these guys are full of fish. All that cooked fish, so we should be making even more yellow points. How are we doing on um, production of yellow points? We're spending. Ooh, we're spending a lot of them. <laughs> But look, we're making tons! We're making heaps! Every time they run out of fish, they get sold like a whole bunch of fish. Which just uh, is kind of perfect. You know what? We could, um, we could remove some road here. Span this farm a bit. Oh, look, it's using all that water to water these tiles. I do need to get the... You know what? This... And they put themselves in a weird pattern here. <laughs> this is exactly what these guys are good for, right? Because we don't need much fertilizer in here. We just need... I think one wagon should be able to deliver the fertilizer we need. Although it is a little... It is a little bit of a distance to go. We'll get two wagons doing it. I hope I clicked the right building. Yes, I did. So we got two wagons delivering fertilizer to this farm. And it, it barely needs any fertilizer. It needs like... It needs it like irregularly. But that will start like uh, getting this grain to grow faster. Have we not got grain on all these spots? What the hell? <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> and that happened. Then we can get some more workers in here and this will be producing more grain. Four workers. Seems good. That way well. Extract it faster. Okay, four workers might be too many. Three workers? Oh, no, the problem is this guy's not processing fast stuff. He needs more workers. Put four workers in there. Okay, this guy's using up the input now? Pretty much. Yeah, that seems fairly stable. Now this guy's getting more... flour. Which means we can put an extra worker in here. Yeah, that, that looks stable. Okay. Why is the tooltip saying? <laughs> That's, uh, output's not filling up. Input is going down very slowly. I guess we can put five workers in here.
yeah, input's going down very slowly on that. Which means, I guess we could put another worker in here. Because input on this is going up very slightly. Now its input's going down pretty quickly. We could put another worker in here. I think output is just going to get clogged though. We're going to need more more conveyor belts putting the <laughs> putting the flower in here. That does make sense because uh, it it needs three per. And that one's going to go great, isn't it? It needs three bits of wheat per bit of bread, so having three conveyor belts bringing wheat in should be perfect. And that means we need to be making... And this should be plenty, right? We're making... Uh... They need two each. We should be making like six a second. Almost. There. Now we'll be making over six a second. Oh wait, we're already filling up with only seven workers. This guy is filled up. Could add a pardon me. I could add a yellow coin booster. I don't think I need to. Look, this this thing's producing enough bread now. These guys are gonna get filled up on bread. Yeah, plenty of bread for them. Oh, let's drop a save. Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Um, oh yeah, Forge. That's what we were doing. Forge. Forgey boy. Here we go. And you make... Oops. Just dim. <laughs> Le peep. Just dim. That's, uh, that's, that's how they say it in French. Le, le peep de stem. I'm sure that's not how they say it in, in French, but uh, that's how I say it. I feel like we don't want to mess with this one because it's like supplying just the right amount right now. So I am going to like pull out another, another thing here. It is going to make this a bit awkward, isn't it? we do it like that. Maybe we like pull it out this way. We got space over here. Way more space over here in fact because this is it's nothing under this guy. We got like we got room. We want to just pull it out at a very reasonable level. We probably have space in here, yeah, we could have another layer added in the middle here at some point. Maybe. Mm, actually, no. We just don't have space for another layer. What great planning. <laughs> Come on, why can't I... There we go, now I can click it. We want... Where's my balls? Where's, where's my balls of iron? You, Iron. Oh, it doesn't look like a ball in the thing. It looks like a ball on the conveyor belt, but not in there. Like, I was looking for balls. It's my problem. I'm always, I'm always out here looking for balls, and sometimes I don't find them. Makes me very sad. Very sad to not, to not find balls. I'm mature. Is that? We're gonna have to go up twice. Just around this corner here. See, this is why it's good that we've raised this thing up, because we'll be able to go over this house and still, still not be like too, too high. In fact, we can just come in straight, I'm pretty sure. Oh, we do need to go down like one. There we go. 
so that's obviously not a house. It's a barn. But you know what I mean. House, barn. Same thing. We're gonna, like, mess up this whole, uh, waterfront area. With some more beautiful conveyor belts. I think we want to do that. That. Whoops. Like that. Yes. Oh, in fact, that doesn't need to be like that. That's going too low. And that doesn't need to be like that. I suppose we'll just have it come along like this, and it would just go up at the edge of the barn there. I kind of want to do that. So it looks a bit more uniform there. It still looks kind of weird here. It, it is always going to look kind of weird there. But if we put like a couple more bits in... I don't know. There's just more bits there now. It doesn't look any better or worse. <laughs> Here we go. Um, and now this guy is going to pump steam pipes into here. Yeah. So this will be for steam pipes. You just get... Uh, they can't get pumped in there, can they? That would be too high. That would be... That would be at... This height. Yeah, too high. Okay. Pump it in this back, then. Do I want to have, like, more... More of this underneath? I think I do. I might as well, right? Because it will be a real pain to try to build that after. <laughs> well, you know what I could do? I could have, like... Look, we'll, we'll put the ramp over here. Maybe we'll just have two ramps. <laughs> we don't need the stairs, we'll just do ramps. And then like this. Cause then we don't have to worry about this stupid... Um, what's it called? Yeah, the slopiness. It will, it will be just a, a nice straight... A nice straight guy there. Guy. It's called a conveyor belt. It's not a guy. I mean, it could be. It could be a guy. Like, maybe, uh, maybe conveyor belts are people too. Okay, we do need to get the coal in too. I say we just go over this guy. Every Everything's a guy today. <laughs> just like... Words. Who needs to know the actual words for things when you can just call everything a guy? Hmm. I don't know, like, exactly where we're going to put it in, though. Why did I say it like that? <laughs> I don't know where exactly we're gonna put it in. Do I do I even think? Do I even listen to myself for a second before I open it up? Mm. Is that not gonna go in? Okay. So we're gonna need it to be reasonably low. Okay, good. That's too high to actually try to pull out of there. That's nice. It doesn't look like it is, but uh, it is. So we need to get down to that level. Along here somehow. Should be pretty easy to do. Do we... Maybe just go like that. Well, that works. 
This needs to be like this, because there's a slip underneath. There we go. Perfect. And this pulls coal. And this thing is going to start working. I am. I'm going to quickly go and grab myself a drink. Uh, and I'll be right back. I'll, I'll just leave. Uh, I'll just leave this running. You can watch. You can watch the pipes coming out. <laughs>
Hello. <laughs> I'm back. I'm back. I'm hydrated. <laughs> I'm ready for more conveyor belt action. Are we not getting enough, uh... But, look at that. <sighs> Thank you, Iron Jesus. <laughs> we have 16 research points left, that's it. Mine shafts can be built underground to extend the range of mines. Nearby underground resources can be accessed and harvested infinitely. Oh, beautiful. Supply pickaxe. Supplying pickaxes will speed up the underground mining process. Well, that is beautiful. It's something I am very happy, very happy to know. Um, this guy. No. No longer will you make those. You're going to start making these ones. Which means this whole conveyor belt here, this bit doesn't need to be there, right? This is... I'm pretty sure this is the, uh... <laughs> yeah, this has to be the, the metal one. Which will no longer be for metal. Uh, it will be instead for wheels. Wait, we do need to be paused actually, because I gotta move this this guy back. I love that sound. <laughs> okay, so we got we got the mine, <laughs> just like in the middle of the city. Looks a little bit weird. Now we can set him on. Supply pickaxes and generate iron ore. So we just need to like pump pickaxes into him. Easy. We can do that. I think we'll just, just go straight there. This one can just like float across the water. That's fine. Ruin the waterfront some more. Oh. Well. Whoops. Oh, fucking goddamn it. <laughs> How have I managed to flip those around again? Okay, there we go. Second time lucky. Missing some bits in there. Good. And... No, now we just need those, and then we're perfect. Woohoo! You... Axes of picking. Pickaxes. And, oh shit, we can, um, yeah, I'm gonna need to do a big select. Select columns, all these columns. Get rid of it all. None of that is needed anymore. These guys, not needed. In fact, even up to here, they're not needed. We can, uh, we can, oh, we can fully, like, we can just, like, pull this all the way out to here. Why not? <laughs> Give ourselves a bit more land to build on. That, that is nice. I think it's mostly in range of the, uh, the town center. Wait, is that one not? That one's definitely like... No, it's not. It's like flat. <laughs> Doesn't look like it's flat. Put the bricks in. Road this whole thing up. Maybe we can have like 
What if we have like some kind of little inlets for the water? Like the water is meant to go under there. Through these little little holes. <laughs> Maybe not quite exactly like that, but I I like the idea of it. Because then we can have this go across across the other side. But also the river can continue underneath. That's something which happens in like real cities. At least like in older cities, they'd often like uh build over the river. Or build over Usually they build over like little streams and stuff like tributary tributaries <laughs> tributaries to like the major rivers, but we're just building over the main river. Actually, is this the main river? More of like a a lake. Yeah, I guess it's a it's a bit of a river. It's kind of like a an extravagant bay. <laughs> that's what I, that's what I'm gonna call it. Okay, so if we like, that's not the one, okay, I feel like it's not removing the one I'm clicking on <laughs> most of the time here, oh, that's not right. There we go. No we'll wait. Yeah. It's gonna be great. I mean, it's, it's not gonna be that good, but it's gonna be kind of interesting. It's something we haven't done before. Yeah. It's kind of nice. A river can like flow through there. Wonder if I want it. I kind of like want stone on the ground in there, <laughs> since you can see in there now. But we're not even going to be looking in here very often. But <laughs> you know what? It's fun to beautify. Even even if it's kind of pointless. Okay, yeah, so how do we do this? Probably just have like two two spots here here and There we go, now that looks alright in there. Cover that up a bit more. Yeah, get that in. Get these guys in. Oops. Blah, blah, blah. That's kind of like on the other side. I would like more over here, but those will just be looking at this blank, blank wall bit here. Yeah, maybe that's fine. If I like put that in there too. Mm. Yeah. That looks fine. We'll have some more like jetty. It's not really a jetty, is it? Some more like I mean boardwalk boardwalk? <laughs> boardwalk. That's that's what it is. Do, 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 do. But it will just go to the end there, not and it won't boardwalk won't continue over here because we don't want to cover up our cool like inlets which I've built. They look way too cool for us to cover them up. <laughs> look how awesome they are. <laughs> They're not that cool, are they? Oh, and then what if? 
Okay, instead of having that there, because it does look a bit naff. We'll have some more boardwalk here. Also, nothing is using this, right? Yeah, this guy is useless now. He was once... Once of great service. But now he is... He is nothing to me. And he will be destroyed. <laughs> Only, only those things which are pleasing to me, maybe I'll, are allowed to remain. We can have like a cool, um, cool little like staircase here, going up, up like this way. Oh shit! And now, now that can be all like nicer, because the well's gone. Well, well, well. Uh, stairs, stairs. Platform, platform, platform. Yay! Hmm, actually, I kind of want. I kind of want to bring him. Out like this. For some reason, that looks better to me. Do this like that. Man, it's it's doing something weird. When I delete lower down ones, it deletes higher up. Oh, when I delete the one down here, it also deletes the one that's on the surface of the water. I swear that wasn't happening before, but maybe it's just I haven't done much work in the water. Hmm. It might be a new bug. There's been a recent a recent patch. Okay, we're almost almost ready to unpause. These guys can be connected up. Man, we can have like a Uber production going again. Just like we could get a third one going over there. Although <laughs> I have no idea how I would get that third one in over here maybe. We can move this across and get a third one going in there. In the future. Or maybe now. Because this guy's now going to be, like, producing at, like, literally full rate now, right? Uh, mining layer. Build more pits. Ah, oh, I see. They need to be, like... Oh, what? Oh, there's more. There's more that becomes revealed as you build, like, shafts next to it. Oh, was that already revealed down there? And I would, maybe it was already there. Yeah, I think it might have already been there. <laughs> well, so we don't need all this on the sides. It's like trim off the excess, and all these pickaxes can go back into my inventory. Can we, like, come up to here? Like, does that work? Oh, that's not where it was, it's here. <laughs> How many pickaxes do we have? Not quite enough. Wait, it's not pickaxes we're out of, it's uh, money. This stuff costs quite a bit to build. Let's see. Oh, well, that's, that's going fine as is, right? I don't know what these these guys are. These circles. They're like places where an ore deposit could be, but isn't. <laughs> I don't know. Ooh, what have we got? We got some new research available. No, we don't. Why is it glowing? Whatever. Uh, let's get... Yeah, what? Why are pipes going in there? Pipes aren't meant to be going in there. That's meant to be for pickaxes. Stupid pipes. Get out of there. It's not the pipes' fault. It's my fault. I should have, uh... <laughs> I 
I should have specified what was meant to go in that that thing. And I didn't. Very silly of me. There we go. This takes out... Uh, wheels. Iron wheels. And we also need heat bays. Oh wait, we need we need level one tomes as well. To make the level two tomes. Oh shit. <laughs> oh, no. Okay, well. Whoops. Let's delete those iron wheels in there then. You still make level one tomes. Because that's the one that the books are popping into. We'll make, we'll, we'll have to build one next to it here. Um, like right here. Build another one. A laboratory. Sim like, sim near. Yeah, that's fine. And this guy will make, oh, I didn't mean to put that in. <laughs> This guy will make level two, level two domes. I mean, we we got plenty of wheels. That's fine. I mean, maybe oh, maybe it should just the wheels should come this way, right? Oh, I see. This is not quite at the right level. Perfect. So, some of those wheels got... Well, I mean, nothing is actually lost when you delete stuff in this game. It's just... It goes into my, uh... Into the town... The town centre inventory. So now we've got a bunch of wheels randomly in here. All this other random junk. God. Uh, it's alright to have some random junk in the in the inventory. Oh, I I guess all of these are in here because uh, every time I replace a conveyor belt with a different thing. We're not getting enough leather in. Why are we not getting enough leather in? We're still not... <laughs> we're not getting enough, like, output of, uh... An animal feed. Man, leather is so hard to generate. Maybe... Maybe it is worthwhile to... Wasn't there, like, a thing where you could sell gold, sell gold for leather? Somewhere. No, it's jam. Jam for leather. How much jam? One jam for six leather. We could just build like Jam Town over here and be rolling in the leather. Go delete a whole bunch of glass grass so I can see what I'm doing over here. Or oh, so I can like figure out which part of this land is actually worthwhile to build on. I guess with the trees they can go on these slopes because they're not they're not such bad slopes. So we need a forester making an apple jam. We need a sugar farm. And we need fuel? What, what else do we need for jam? Fuel, yeah. We need tons of apples, a little bit of sugar and a little bit of fuel. We can, like, send fuel from somewhere, from over here. Oh yeah, this guy will be able to work uh, with the mining layers now, too. Look at all these uh, coal deposits we can deep mine. 
Yeah, look. Oh, yeah, they, they change color because they become activated when you build a... Uh... So I guess all these spots don't need to exist. It, it just needs to be connected somehow. Yeah, okay. So that spot needs to exist. It's connected there too. No, that's not. It's only connected in the spots where it absolutely has to be. There we go. Now this guy can actually uh, do some more... Uh, tell him to also supply pickaxes. Oh, that means we need to send pickaxes. <laughs> we need to send pickaxes to him as well. He can come out of here. Oh, they could just like come along this way. I think that's fine. Let's go, go along this way. I don't think a conveyor belt can go there. Oh, it can. No, it can't. <laughs> I was right to think it couldn't go there. We need to. We need to do it from this angle to be able to place these properly. <laughs> I just want to go in like a straight line, which means we need to do some going up, going up some hills. I guess this one can go there. We don't want to be... I mean, I say we don't want to be doing any using any access. <laughs> There's not really any any worry there, is there? Using excess wood. We have so many planks. You grab pick axes. Pick axe. Pick axe. Beautiful. Get the little supports in there. Can we? Come on. No, we don't. We can't put a support in there. It looks like you. You could, right? I guess not. <coughs> Pardon me. <laughs> Just like dropping away. Got the plague. Here we go. Now we supply pickaxes to it. This guy's got all the pickaxes he needs. And this guy... Man, I love the deep mining. Deep. Hey, are we out of pickaxes? How are we out of pickaxes? So we're not getting any metal in here. Because we don't have enough metal coming in? What? What's the metal problem? I should have plenty of metal coming in here. It's because it's all coming along this one conveyor belt, I guess. Now we're just low on metal. Um, it's probably just the metal. Uh, the metal needs to catch up again. It will do. Like we're producing enough metal, I think. It's just. Uh, it's just that. Actually, maybe we're not. Maybe we're using more metal than we're producing. It doesn't seem to be going up in here at all. But we got that big shortage when the mines run out. See, we've got plenty of, like, unrefined metal. 
in here. We just need this guy to be working faster. Maybe it's Steam Booster time. Build like a little Steam thing down here. Get the Steam Boosters going. A Steam Generator. Put this guy like... Down, down here somewhere. It kind of needs to be on the water. So it's, it's getting automatically supplied with water. That's actually not a bad spot for it. Steam gen. Oh. Oh, that was the spot. Let's see. Also not terrible. Bum, 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 bum. I kind of like it being being out over here. Does mean we need to. Uh, we won't be getting the happiness boost because it's probably out. Yeah, it's out of the range of the town center. Okay, let's move him over here. It'll be a little bit harder to get stuff to him, but that's fine. I think we probably want to. Look, this can be like water and steam area over here. We do a little where we do all our water and steam things. There. Beautiful. Uh, is that? That's good. I think we want to fill up all that with road as well. Just because. <laughs> no good reason, just because. Okay, so now you can... Well, we don't want to fill up the entire thing with the road, right? Because we need some room for our steamy boy. Well, There we go. Steamy boy. Away. Yeah, that looks cool. Looks all high tech, doesn't it? Yeah. Okay. I didn't mean to press add yellow coin booster. I did not realize you can move these things around. <laughs> it needs... No, oh, it needs fuel. It's got water. It's only getting one water per second. But uh, I guess that's fine. We can also get water to it from the uh, from the well right next door. How much water does this make? Maybe not enough. What's that? Better check. Oh my god. My stupid phone. Here we go. I got the screen to turn on. Amazing. Oh, it's my optometrist. Reminding me that I have an appointment tomorrow. Thanks. Thanks, optometrist. I have to get my, my eyes rechecked. grabbing from there. Oh, let's rotate the grabber. Genius. Here we go. Now this guy has his own well to get input because I feel like this guy's probably gonna need a lot of uh, a lot of water. And look we've got we got like coal right here which we could get in. This coal line which I just built earlier. Here's one I prepared earlier. Can we, like, select this and rotate it? No. We can do that. And then split it. It's not going to try to go in there, fortunately. Even though it looks like it would. Hey, that's 
that's a like, that's a pretty little bridge, isn't it? Kind of. Pretty enough. I mean, pretty enough for a conveyor belt bridge. I like it because it comes up to the same level as this. And then it's going to go down under there. Boom, boom, boom. And then that's going to be needs to come down to this level here. Actually, it could even come lower. Like it could come all the way down to that level. Well, if it's able to, that would be awesome. Uh, can we like come stop. Stop doing this to me. Okay. There we go. Man, it's uh, getting harder to work in this area, isn't it? Look, that can that can be like that, and then these bits. Just because I want them to look like they're actually supported by something. You know? But like, carts and people can still get it under there. This is good because we, we need this to be high enough up so it's not interfering with the well's access to water. But this should be ideally high. There we go, it's going to start producing, uh, producing the old uh, steam now. Bay. Uh, B. Again, the pipe sub menu. So we need a steam pipe connector. Where do we need to get this steam to? <laughs> Up here, right? Where was it? This guy, this forge needs the steam. Oh boy. Um. We go over here. Steam pipe connector. Will that work? Hopefully. Steam pipe. Oh, we need to like go from here though. Because the pipes, like the direction you drag them, affects affects how they go. This guy is an output. And steam pipes. We need it to go up. The good thing about the steam pipes is you can just kind of go directly up. So you don't have to. Is that too high? I think I just want it to come. I kind of want it. I want it to go like over this way, right? Like if you see next to there, I want it to go like that. I guess. I guess we can like draw a bit, a bit this way, just to get an idea of where I want it to meet up. Is that the same height? Oh, it needs to be one higher. No, two higher. Oh, we can just... Do that. <laughs> Steam going in? Steam booster. Steam's going in. Look at that. Boosted. Yeah, woo, boost. 
is that like is that improving our output? How much output is it without the booster? I can't like remove the booster now to test. <laughs> Does it tell me how? Okay, we're getting plus one per second from that. Guess we need to add some yellow coins as well. I want to see this thing just like... Like a continuous stream of iron coming out. I need to make sure it's not chewing through all of its input as well. But it shouldn't be, because it's getting input from two... Well, one and a half bits. Wait, how is... Oh yeah, that's coming under there. Like, I thought I had another one here, but I remember now I, I put it down there instead. It seems to be... I think it's very slowly running out of uh, coal, <laughs> so I could uh, I could always build another another coal inputter. Is that gonna is that gonna work? Hopefully. Looks like it will. Oh. Damn, now it won't it won't run out of coal. Give it another yellow coin booster. See how that goes. The output's still not getting full. Looks like it's just like a steady stream of of iron. Being 10.5 work units a second. We could probably go slightly higher with the coin boosters, but I think as our happiness grows, this will naturally start producing a little bit more, a little bit more iron. There we go. Our iron plates are starting to fill up in there too. Perfect. So soon, um, pickaxes will be getting made again. Maybe I need to add another worker in here. We'll, we'll add a, we'll just add a bunch of workers in there. <laughs> We've only got 30 workers left now. Although we do have... We can build another six houses. Maybe I should build some... Build some houses. Let's, let's just build them up on this level. Oh, but we want to build them floating on... The old, uh... Platform Marinos. One, two, three houses. And here we can have some hedge. Herge. Not herge. Hedge. Hedgy blocks. Beautiful. They get a little bit of a, a nice. <laughs> nice. Gardeny thing there for for him. What a great overlord I am! Look at that! Instantly, instantly making me money. That's that's what we like to see. They probably yeah they won't be getting supplied planks and stuff. What are you doing? Um, you can... A plank stored here. You can bring these guys some planks. Cause we got... We got a thousand planks in there. That is plenty of planks. So we'll up upgrade them with planks, then we'll uh... Do some other stuff. How is this guy going with its manure? Perfect. That one wagon is supplying it with all the manure it needs. Our bread line is now full. Perfect. 
We've got 20 bread in there, 20 fish in there, so anytime anyone's hungry, instantly, they get a, they get a fish sandwich. Yeah, fish burgers. It's good. I think fish burgers are underrated, right? Like, not enough places sell them. I'm talking like, like, nice, like, battered fish in a burger. <laughs> As if, like, battered fish wasn't already bad enough for you. <laughs> just stick it in a burger to make it, yeah, just like, <laughs> even worse for you and even better tasting. How far can we go out here? I might be able to fit another couple houses in here. Well, we might we might have to do some rearranging. Or maybe we'll just have some houses that aren't connected to the school. That's not the end of the world. They won't generate research, but they'll still generate happiness and stuff as long as they're connected to like as long as they're connected to this guy. They'll generate happiness. And, and this guy. And they'll generate coins. Look, it all have red coins. I wish I could, like, trade red coins for yellow coins. Because <laughs> I've, I've... I don't have very many yellow coins because I spend all my yellow coins on, like, dumb stuff, I guess. This guy's still going well. How are we for stones? Stones. Um, we're not that good on stones. Maybe it's time to get a stone mine going. Where is where is stone? Over here. Oh, and here. Okay, we could build a stone mine up here. Look at that. Perfect spot. Hine. I don't think it really matters which way it's facing, does it? Let's face it like that. Mines do look a little bit funny, like in the middle of town, surrounded by roads and stuff. But that's fine. Mining layer. Mine shaft. Oh, we don't have very many pickaxes, do we? Oh, wait, we have 106. That's... That's plenty. Maybe we don't need it underneath the, the thing. Oh, we've run out of money. <laughs> okay, what can we do about that? We don't want to be running out of money. Do we make... Yeah, we make yellow coins with the, this. Apple jam. Maybe we start apple jam production over here and then we can ship it, ship it over here to turn it into leather once we're producing excess. I think that's a good idea. Look, we've already got apple trees right here. It's like... This place is made for apple jam production. And we can get our forester within range of the uh, the town center. That'll be within range, I'm pretty sure. I think as long as any part of the building is within range, then it's, it's in range. Yeah, look, it's getting the happiness boost. We can just, like, fill this area with trees. Although, we need money for that. But, like, luckily, there's already trees here, so we don't need too much money. Uh, I guess we just want the one thin road, because we want as much space in here to be available for trees as possible. We've already got the coal going past here, which is perfect, because we need the coal. We just need to, like, get some sugar going. There's sugar down there. No, that's grain. The sugar is going to be a bit of an issue, because we need some flat land. This land here is pretty flat. Okay, sorry tomatoes. Sorry, uh, cotton. You're all gone. We need this flat land for our, our farm. Forest, uh, 
farm. Look at that, perfect flat land, almost. There. Perfectly flat? Is that perfectly flat land? It is. So we can grow all the sugar we could possibly need here. It will be outside the range of our town. Okay, I'm going to... I'm going to put the road over here, because that way... Uh, that way it's good. <laughs> but, there. Nice. Um, if I, if I put it with, like, um, yeah, you know what I mean. Like, it, it, it doesn't really need the happiness boosts and stuff, this one. We're not going to need that much sugar. We probably don't even need the full... all the tiles around this farm, but... I'm going to have them just in case. Man, if only I could uh, move it one along, but then we wouldn't, we wouldn't have all these tiles. I think it's... Look, we'll do that. No, well, no we won't. It only needs access, but I don't even know what it needs access for. But it, I'm going to assume it does need some kind of access. So apples, things, coal, and then we'll just build the kitchen, like in here. Oh, actually, not in there, right? <laughs> it's exactly the place I didn't want to build the kitchen. We'll build the kitchen over here. Um, we just like here. I don't want to. I don't want to be too squished up with the the conveyor belts because I know these ones are going to need to go over the con the coal conveyor belt. So we're going to give ourselves plenty of space for that. Here's where the coal will go in. Where's the meat kitchen? Here he is. These guys are all upgraded now, right? Yeah, they need stone bricks now. You... You got a new job. Grab stone bricks and supply these houses with them. I like how it knows. It knows to bring them to the ones that need upgrades first. <laughs> instead of, like, taking them to, like, some dumb house that doesn't need them. Okay, so you make me apple jam. Brilliant. Boom, boom, boom. You know what, I think we are going to need a little bit of... We're going to need, like, a bit more space here, which means maybe... Oh, I don't... The conveyor belt's going to be, like, a, a mess, because I want to be pulling apples out. at a reasonable rate. Okay, I think look, we'll even do like this. So may maybe we'll put the coal in over this side. Yeah, put the coal in over this side. It might even end up being easier to I like it better facing that way. It might end up being easier to have the coal go up and have all these things go underneath, but uh, I don't know. Figure that out. What if we're like, what if we pull like four apples at a time? If we need four, four apples, one sugar, one fuel for each jam. So if we're pulling four apples at a time, that should, uh, that should be perfect. Suppose, suppose we need to, ah. Ah, that's fine. We can block up this bit of road. 
because uh, we are going to need to we're going to need to like block all this up too. And by block up, I mean place blocks on, not actually block up. And then these will need to go over the coal and then in, which should be fine. I think this will work. So that can go straight in, Whoop. and this can go down and then. I said down and then. <laughs> Come on. Down and then. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> That will go like that. That will go like that. You, you make apples. I guess a couple apples are going to start coming out. Maybe. Yeah, there we go. There's an apple. There's another apple. And then we just need to be getting the sugar which can go along like that. You know what? Let's... Let's just like make it go straight along here. Back at that. <laughs> Whoops. Yeah, that that'll be okay. This can just go like alongside alongside the apples. So this will use up a little bit of the space that could be used for sugar sugar growing, but uh, I really don't think that's going to matter, since we don't need that much sugar for jam. We need mostly, mostly apples, right? If anything slows us down in the jam production, well it shouldn't be the apples, since we've got so many conveyor belts bringing apples in. Like look at that, it's full up already. <laughs> Sugar. And we'll give him, um, shit. We should, uh, I should have put these in <laughs> earlier, but there we go. There's only like three slots on that, which are, are actually not available to plant stuff on. Like this has more of its slots being used up, but I think it should be fine. I don't think you need to be like perfectly efficient with these things. Oh, we have to plant them on the uh, the tree. The tree planters, which are twenty each, should be fine. How much of our money have we spent? Oh, like a thousand! Wow. We can't plant it there on that bit of slope. Okay. There's a couple of slopes that we can't put it on in here, but 
mostly we can. Now we're out of money. Okay. Well, let's... Let's just do that much. Because we also need to plant the apple trees. Oh, there's a 50 each. Okay. Um, wait, what? There. Let's delete some of these. In fact, let's delete a whole bunch of them out here too, because we need to we need to also plant some sugar. Oh, we also need to get sh sugar. We need to get our uh, water to this sugar farm and and manure. We still have to get the manure to this guy too. Actually, we could just get the manure to this with the uh, a car, like the other one. Okay, manure. Fertilizer. You go here. No nearby crops. Oh yeah, because we haven't planted the sugar yet. Plant some sugar. Pour your sugar on me, baby. <laughs> I'm going to make your life so sweet. Oh, we used exactly all our coins on the sugar. Wow. <laughs> couldn't have, you couldn't have planned that, right? That's just <laughs> what a magic moment. So this guy should start producing sugar soon. To put a grabber on there. Um, it does need water to water. Just the water here. Just pull that around here. Ooh, maybe not. I think we're gonna have to get rid of some trees in here. Pull the water around this way. just go like that but I think uh, I think I'd rather have it follow the the cold one around yeah that's just gonna look better uh, there we go good height oh it will need to come up to get up on here won't it I feel like the coal guy should just come up at the same point. Makes makes sense, doesn't it? And it will look a lot a lot prettier to have them uh, lined up like that. Here we go. I don't know if I'll need um try to get rid of these these trees. I don't know if I need to have the uh the old bricks out here. Is that within range of the, the town center? Uh, some of it is. Okay. Well we'll brick up a bit of this. Just a bit that's like within range of the town center. Let's delete some of these under there so we're not being so wasteful with our bricks. There we go. Maybe I should just like have this come out all the way out here. Hmm. Yeah. Let's. Let's do it. Whoop. That angle on that one. Better, better, better. Better, better. And you know what? We don't need we don't need bricks under all of this. 
let's just do it with wood. As long as there's something under there, the road doesn't care. This is all going to be covered up under there. Really doesn't matter. And also probably we'll be deleting some of it at some point anyway. And this way we can have like full on ramps all the way along. Which will help to make sure this guy can get his supply. From, from the old uh, party boys. I think we can get Farm tiles under here with sugar on them and still plant and still put these guys there. Yeah, we can. Perfect. Now it's just a matter of two straight lines. Blammo and Blammo. Easy. Now this guy will be getting fertilizer very slowly from the car, but. <laughs> He shouldn't need that too quickly. He'll be getting water automatically. We don't have to worry about that. It's producing sugar already. Hey, look at that. We're full up on uh, on jam in here now. Um, I will be back in one moment. And the game's back. <laughs> Excellent. Oh, the sugar is starting to back up. Actually, a nice thing. A nice thing to see. Man, we just need more, um... More gold. Or oh, yellow coins. There we go. I kind of want to have this like road continue out this way. Maybe we'll just like delete these ones, get our money back for those ones. They haven't been fertilized here or anything, right? <laughs> well, if they had, too bad. I don't think they had. Yeah, they turned brown when they being fertilized. <laughs> Brown, because fertilizer is poo poo. <laughs> this will be plenty big enough. Oh, 
What does the sugar cost us? 40 each. Ah. I think the apple trees are more important to plant first. We're not going to get that many in, like... There we go. I, I suppose we should just start pumping this, um... Oh no, the hedges. I'm sorry guys, your hedges are... They were short-lived, weren't they? It's just such a perfect spot to run this... <laughs> run this pipe. You know what? I think these guys should move over here. Just one over. They're still in range of this guy, right? Yeah, easily. Just because then we can run pipes behind them. Pipes. <laughs> conveyor belts. Well, we could run pipes too, but I was thinking of conveyor belts. For some reason, I called them pipes. Okay, let's like... Oh, I've got an idea for something which will look a bit, uh, a bit spiffy here, maybe. We're going to have our conveyor belts. What if we have, like, a wall here? A wall with a conveyor belt on it. What? Crazy. How does he come up with these amazing ideas? What a genius this guy is. <laughs> or is he? Maybe he's an idiot, because maybe this can't be used. We're gonna have to like put a guy here and tell him to go here. I don't know it can't be used. Oh, but maybe not by the wagons. No, that wagon was going over there. He didn't need to cross under here. You, yeah, okay, good. Thanks, wagon. Go back. <laughs> You've done your duty. <laughs> Showing me that a wagon can pass under there. Here we go. Here we go. Actually. <laughs> just waste some jam. Oh good. <laughs> I mean, I could just have, like... Wait, what? You can't build these on those. Huh. There are, like, stone... Stone bench? Stone scaffold ramps. I guess those will work. Doesn't look quite as nice as I was hoping, though. We make them wood instead. Nah, I guess they're fine as stone scaffold ramps like that. Now that's a very low clearance here, isn't it? You're a tall guy in this town. You smashing your head on there all the time. You wouldn't want to live in these houses. <laughs> we call it the decapitator. This bridge. Here we go. Jam's pumping into the the tavern pretty quick. Wow. Look how quick our coins have shot up. I think we must have just sold a whole bunch of jam. Well, let's plant some more apple trees. See, every time these coins come in, we reinvest them in our jam production. Oh, this guy. This guy does not want, need to exist. He's outside the range of the Forester. Look at that, that's only like less than half of the uh, area that we've got used up. Seems to be producing a reasonable amount. Whoa, quick access. E, I have not pressed E before. What? Oh my god. This is way better than the build menu. 
Like, everything's just, like, in its little categories. And you can use keyboard shortcuts to get to it all. Uh... And packages. I haven't, uh, haven't used a packager yet, but it feels like... Feels like they could be quite useful for... Moving large amounts of things around. Maybe we'll use a packager to package up jam. Take it down here. Unpackage the jam. Package up the leather. Bring the leather here. Then, like, uh, then we can do it with caravans. And it will be, like, reasonably efficient if it's all packaged up, right? I assume. <laughs> we do still need our big, uh, big old bridge going over this way. Wait, do we? I don't know if I'm still on board with that idea. That was to get cake. <laughs> yeah, maybe we should. Like, cake looks like it's a total... A real pain to make. It sells for a lot. It sells for more than jam. Yeah, look, this guy's not pumping out the apples. Currently. We need more tree planters. So most of the slopes they can be placed on. Oh, I think there is one on there too. I think all these slopes. Yes. Beautiful. Oh. But up. Just waiting for my yellow coins to tick up. Why can't I spend red coins on these trees? I've got, I've got 67k of those. Problem is, like, we use some of our red coin... Uh, red. We don't use any of our red coins. We use some of our yellow coins to, like, make some of our production faster. Which of these things really need to have yellow coin boosters in them? I mean, none of these do. What does? We could use red coins to make more fish, but I've, I do feel like we don't really need it. Oh, we could get, uh, get some steam going on this guy. But then we don't really need that either. We're... <laughs> We've got like plenty of fish in here, right? Yeah, plenty of fish. Where are we using the yellow coin boosters? This forge. We need them in this forge. Oh, or do we? Look. I guess the output is full, so we can... Oh, the output might just be full, because this thing's full. Yeah. Well, shit. <laughs> um... Okay. We want to have, like... Yeah, this whole mess here. Need to sort this out. <laughs> that should be good there. Blah, 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 blah. Uh oh. The police are coming for me. They heard, uh, they heard I've been placing way too many conveyor belts. I don't know if you can hear the sirens. <laughs> if you can't hear the sirens, then that probably makes no sense to you. But uh, if I can hear them with my um, like noise cancelling headpoint headpoints, my noise cancelling headpoints on, then um, I assume that you can hear them. be good. This should, like, go in like that, right? Yes. Oh. But wait. There's a problem. 
That's what the police were really coming at me for. I'm not building too many conveyor belts, but building my conveyor belts wrong. An infraction punishable by death, sadly. So, um, rip me. They're gonna execute me for my, uh, for my misdeeds. Honestly, I deserve it. Misplacing, uh, <laughs> misplacing these, uh, conveyor belts. Is there any worse crime? I don't think so. Here we go. Now we just need to get the pipes in there, too. Pipes are getting made here. Oh, but they get pumped in here, so yeah, perfect. Pipes. Oh, like this. Boom, 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 boom. I mean, this could just be straight across. Like, in fact, it could just go at this level. That's probably even better. Yeah, yeah. Then it doesn't have to like rise up quite so high. I think we want that to not be an angled bit. Just because we might want to have other things going on here. Oh, we've got angles going over it already. <laughs> yeah, fine. We'll make we'll make it an angled bit then. Whoa. Slow down there, mouse clicks. It's a bit out of control. Blam. Blam, 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 blam. Here we go. Bam, bam, bam. Ba da da ba bo. Ba da ba ba bo. Ba da ba da ba ba bo. You take out. Keep base. Here's all of my peepees. Coming, coming up here. Coming right in. And we should now be producing the Omega books. Oh shit, yeah, I needed to sort this guy out too. This guy needs to get... He needs to be delivered, uh, these. I guess they could just come out. They could just come off of there. Split off. Kind of makes sense. It's not really much more efficient than coming straight out there, but a little bit better. Hmm. Yeah, maybe that can stay. That can stay. It's all like crazy, <laughs> crazy system of stairs and stuff. <laughs> I think this needs to be at this level. Which means it can just like, it can go up perfectly parallel with this for most of its, uh, most of its climb, which will look nice. And then it will just keep climbing when this one stops. Bum, 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 bum. Bum, 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 ta -da! It's like that. Ba, 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 ba. Oh, that's easy. Now this guy's getting picks. And this is already like right next to where um where the stones need to end up. Which is perfect. And even... Oh, it's even on the right level. Oh, shit. <laughs> Everything worked perfectly, except for... <laughs> except for the way I placed these guys. Oh, actually, it's not on the right level. It looked like it was on the right level when I placed the things wrong. <laughs> There we go. Further. 
but um, I mean, oh, this this beautiful conveyor belt though, I love it. I guess is it's gonna disappear. Well, it can stay for now until this guy runs out of stone. Wait, it's already run out of stone. Oh no, he's deep mining now, so he'll never run out of stone. Yeah, we can we can leave that there. Why not? <laughs> uh, actually, it seems to be interfering with this one's ability to output stone. Oh no, this guy's just not outputting enough stone. Okay, well, that can be fixed. Sure. Those six guys can work in here now instead. In fact, ten guys can work in here. Let's go crazy. I guess I connect this back up, just so that I can just have a cloth one again. <laughs> so every now and then one of these will go on, and then eventually this whole thing will get emptied out of stones and we won't waste any. <laughs> Perfect. Uh, so. This needs to send stuff to here. Ba -ba 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 -ba. One too high. Ba -dum. Ba -dum. That'll work. Oh. Oh. So close. So close to getting it perfect on the first try. No, grab and no grabbing. Grab and no grabbing. And if, if Swiper was called Grabber, it's not quite as good a name, is it? Grab and no grabbing. <laughs> Yay! Oh. Well, those ten books <laughs> went out. I guess the others is going to take a bit longer to make. That's fine. We'll generate a whole bunch of industrial research points. Oh my god, look at all the research we've generated. We're producing way too much paper now. <laughs> the old uh, paper mill is running out of control. It's because our happiness has like, doubled since we assigned all these workers to it. Yeah, there we go. The output's not going to be so ridiculous now. Look at all the books we're making too. This thing's full up on uh, on leather. Does that mean this guy's full of leather too? No. I I guess we've just been making so many books. Look at that. We got a hundred books. That's plenty, I'm not going to bother upgrading this bar. I do realize now, I could, uh... I could be... Huh. Interesting. <laughs> Interesting how all this works. I could be storing these books in the bar. No, there's no point. They, The only thing they're useful for is going into the school, so there's no point storing them. What could I store in this bar? Anything? There's not really anything worth storing in there. How are we going with stones coming in? Some of the stones have to go here to this machine shop to make rails, I see. But not many. So stones... I guess they're, like, they're coming out at the exact rate that they're coming in. Which is just as fast as this guy can output them. Which is as fast as the as fast as we could possibly Hey look at that! All these stones have like Wow. That was quick. I expected it to take take a lot longer for them to to like drain out. Some of these are gonna you know what? It's easier to replace that one bit of road than to like <laughs> mess around with all of this. I'm 
just gonna leave the wood bit there. It can um it can stay as a m memorial to the uh the old the old conveyor belt that no longer is. Is that within range of the town centre? No. So that's kind of useless land out here. Okay, so if we... No, it's not this one. Which is the one? This one. Where we want to take the jam. We will need to make a road that leads out there. It would make sense if it's linked up to our jam production facility. Hmm. It would also make sense to have a barn like right next to here or something. Maybe over the road here. Whoa. <laughs> Easy there, camera. Like Go on crazy on me. Do we, we want to like properly do this one because this one will be exposed. Yeah. At least for now it will be exposed. Do I don't know if it will stay exposed. with that and I I guess this will be on the level with that or will this be up on this level yeah this will be up on this level with uh whatever the hell goes up here eventually I think this is a good spot though because up here is actually within range of the TC maybe that's what we call him now Mr. TC Town center. Too hard to say. TC. That's what, that's what all the cool kids are calling it. Yeah, that's in range of the town center, so um yeah. <laughs> after all that talk of calling it TC, I went straight back to town center. <laughs> this area is actually inaccessible. So we need to give it some like ramp access or something. Like we definitely will, because this is where our bridge is going to be. So maybe like, because we've already got all this like, all this like ramp business next to it. How about we just extend that out and have will this work? Stop! Stop game! Stop doing that to me! <laughs> yeah, it will. Okay, we, we will need to like fix up this a little bit, make that a bit nicer. There we go, perfect. Put some rain in there. You know what? I kind of want that to line up with that. There we go. We got a nice like big wide road that splits off in two different directions. We go down to the docks. Like the uh, the garment district <laughs> where all the garments are made, or you can um, come down here to the uh, the special special barn, which is just gonna sit right here. Yeah, let's put it like that. That looks nice. It's like lined up with the with the road. Beautiful. And now we need some silly conveyor belt coming over here. Better, better, better. And it will no. I said that one. <laughs> it will go like this. 
that's not what I wanted at all. What have I done? Actually, this could be useful. I, I've done a, a, like a stupid thing, but maybe, <laughs> maybe it will end up being the smartest thing I ever did. Also, where did that uh, a guy delivering stone bricks go? This guy. You don't need to be doing that anymore. Okay, do one more delivery. Nobody wants them? Yeah, everyone's full up on stone bricks, you idiot. <laughs> they need nails now. Get them some nails. Nails are here. Man, how, how do I know? How did I know that the nails were there? <laughs> It's like I designed this whole town. Okay, we are going to actually have to do some... Something a little wacky, maybe? No, it's not going to be too wacky at all. It's going to be relatively unwacky. Wait, what? Why is there a grabber here? <laughs> How long has that been there for? It's randomly grabbing. Oh no. I don't want it splitting that way. I don't want it like putting stuff directly in the house. We like... Oh, fine. I guess it, this house will just get some direct jam deliveries. That's fine. This is not going to be low enough, is it? It is there, though. So let's just do that. There we go. So, wait, why? Is, why are there bricks in here? Now the jam's going in the wrong slot. I want the jam in the first slot. <laughs> jam. The rest of these slots are going to be closed off. It's just like fully upgraded. Uh, man, what a waste of jam. We have to delete that jam because this... this I, think, I think the wagon put that bit of stone in that in the uh, in the barn. It's like, I don't know what to do with it. So... We'll probably also, like... At some point, we're going to start delivering something else into here, like cheese or, like, stew or cake or something. So maybe fish stew? What do we need for that? Tomatoes? Butter? Yeah, so eventually this like this old fish conveyor belt will get will get retired. And instead of making like four coins per fish, we'll be making twenty coins per fish stew. Because we've got tons of fish. We just need butter. Which we need milk. So we'll I guess we'll get another uh, another bit of like animal farming going on down here. We've got plenty of space for it. And you know what? It doesn't need it. It actually doesn't need to be next to the water. Now, how like our pastures? It just needs to be near the water so the well can be like nearby and pump stuff into it. Maybe we'll knock down all this forest here. Build it over here. Get some. Uh, Cut the grass here. You know, like, really build up the industry here. The town center comes out to here, so that's that's good. Let's put like a little little thing there to <laughs> indicate the edge of where the town center reaches. Now the pastures do need to be on the rain. So that is quite a constraint. Put one like here. Maybe just, yeah, we'll put it over here. Look at that, look how like hilly it is where that pasture is. I think you might be able to like see through the pasture to see that there's nothing, like no wall back there. Yeah, you just about can, I think. <laughs> But now you can't see, because there is some, there is wall there. So you can't see that there's no wall, because there is not no wall. Uh, let's just build another little layer up here. 
but a nice little spot to sit. Let's get a bench here. Stone bench. A couple stone benches. No, that looks dumb. One stone bench. I don't really like the stone bench. Maybe we get a wood bench. The wood bench just looks nicer. What other nice decor is there? What a plant. There we go. Bit of beautification. The uh, kitchen workers can come out here on Smoko and just like gaze out at the beautiful <laughs> fish conveyor belts. It's maybe not the nicest place to sit, but that's the place I've given you to sit, so deal with it. Okay, I don't need that anymore because I'll just know it's in line with the edge of this is where the edge of my town center range is, right? Yeah, pretty much. I could probably get stuff just slightly further out. Um, oh, this will need... Does this have road access? Oh, I think it does. Somehow. This road counts as giving access to it. Well, I'm not going to complain. I mean, I, I might complain, but I'm not going to complain about that. <laughs> I kind of, I kind of want to have a bit more road coming down here anyway. You make milk. This guy's also going to be making uh, manure for us, I guess. I guess we could pop it in here, but like this is already full of manure. Maybe we just make a nub. Look, we can pump some manure in here. We'll, we'll store it with the jam. It'll, it'll give our jam like a really unique flavor. So when we trade the jam off to these to, the, to these people for their leather, they'll be like, oh, how do you get that like earthy taste in the jam? Was that a secret? It's our, our secret recipe. It's something to do with the way we store it. <laughs> oh man, look at look at the industry research points we're getting now, jeez. We can just unlock all this shit. Just like every single bit of industry research. Well, not the... I mean, most of them need red coins too, which we've got... A lot of. What do we need to upgrade this? Antidotes and blue coins. We need to get our, like, med medical industry on. Um, I guess there's not much point making these anymore. So I'll just turn this guy off for now. Hey, there's no um there's no things which need industrial knowledge. There might be some further down here, but it doesn't look like it looks like they're all magic related. Maybe there's like magic research points. There are fire research points, water, earth, air, star, star coins, a special reward for sending offerings to the Omni Temple. Used for completing infinite research. What? <laughs> okay, that sounds uh, sounds awesome. And also, I don't know what it is. Let's get well. Put the well here. Make a little thing. Platform. There. Oh, 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 oh. Something might go here, but who knows? <laughs> but now I'm just like making it look nice. I'm gonna leave like a three by three gap in there. So if I, I do want to put something in, it will be. Oh, how about like that? Yeah. Bit of steps action. And there's still a ramp, so the uh the thing with bobs could get in. 
the wagons. Okay, you do that. Kitchen. We're gonna need a couple kitchens around here. And I really need to like fix the <laughs> fix the random elevation issues. That will make a spot up here where stuff can go. Like kitchens. This guy is gonna produce butter. Perfect. So we can just like pump the milk straight into it. I think this will be too high though. It won't be able to pull out, no. Don't you hate it when you're too high to I can't finish that. <laughs> I can't finish that uh this stupid joke with the straight face. So I won't. <laughs> I think we need to like come come up here some yeah nice um because we can hopefully this will be able to pull out yeah 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 yeah, yeah. I mean, I guess I can just go straight in there. We don't need this to be an accessible bit of road. Um, you grab milk. Oh yeah, we need to grab the um, fertilizer out as well. Maybe we'll just put a, uh, a little a barn down here. Barn's always good. Who doesn't like a nice... A nice barn. Beautiful. This guy will fully upgrade it. <laughs> Close up these. We'll just have two things for fertilizer. Probably something else that we want to put in here, but I don't know what yet. Oh, right. it's good putting it on this level, right? Because then we can just easily pull the fertilizer out. Oh, and you know what? We can also we can also pump. Uh... Hmm. You know what? I'm gonna get rid of that. That doesn't need to exist there, right? Because we've got the other way down here. I guess this way just needs to become a ramp instead of a. Uh... Oh. Okay. It has to be like that. The wooden railing. That's fine. Um, just because then I can have two spots where this will pump. I know what the other thing I want in here just now. And that is... Animal feed. Animal feed. So we can pump animal feed in here. We need two of that. We do need two water as well. So, oh look, we can just go blam, and then on top of it, blam. Hopefully this produces enough. No, it doesn't. <laughs> okay, scrap that. We'll, ha we'll have to have two wells next to each other. We'll, we'll double well it. Let's go like... Uh, I kind of, I kind of do want to have have these raised, even though it's like a little bit pointless. <laughs> Maybe I'll just like raise it up on some stone bricks like that. Grabber, there we go. Now we've got like double well feeding in. These will be double. Um... Man, the grabbers are the wrong way around. because the conveyor belts are the wrong way around. These guys will grab animal feed. Yeah, we just need to figure out a way to get the animal feed into here. Uh, 
Where could a farm go? Be a spot with like good flat ground. Maybe over here we'll just delete all these rocks. Sorry, rocks. You're unnes unnecessary? You're unnecessary. We need a farm here. That is like almost all flat ground. And this farm, it makes sense to have a farm here too, because there's going to be a road going through this way. So it's a, it's a good spot for a farm. We are going to need to like, okay, so there's going to have to be like a bridge going over here, over this coal. Let's start working on that. Pretty boy. Bum, ba, 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 ba. What other structural blocks do we have access to? Brick. Reinforced. Reinforced things. Do these look any good? Eh. Yeah. They look a bit industrial, don't they? Not entirely sure about those ones. I think I, I just need to like put some like temporary bricks in bricks wood in here to like try kind of like figure out how it's gonna line up. Get out of here, trees! Ain't nobody got time for you. Trees always causing trouble. The mere existence is uh, it's an affront to, to everything we stand for here in, in this town. Um, I, I guess, like, some of this is going to get replaced with brick. Because we want to, like, we want to make this look a bit nicer here. Instead of just being this Kind of crazy cliff. Bum, 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 bum. Bum, bum, bum. What? 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 Why, why can't I? Okay. Uh, it's. <laughs> Huh. I guess that's fine. We're gonna need to get in under here and... I think I'm just gonna need to remove these to get in there to fix that up. Look, these bits of brick are just held up by wood. <laughs> don't tell anyone. We don't want, like, sappers coming in here and... ...messing with our... Messing with our beautiful foundations. Okay, we've rode it all up. The road needs to come out here. So I guess this is where the bridge starts on this side. Bum, bum, bum. Bum, bum, bum. Bum, 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 bum. I'm thinking there'll be like big pillars in it or something. You know, big like stone pillars. Or at least like big stone bits at the edges. Yeah, maybe we'll just have like some big like stone bits coming out at the edges and then the inner bits. The inner bits? <laughs> They're kind of like the actual span of the bridge will be more, um, less stony. Maybe we would make it like kind of symmetrical. No, we'll have like four layers out here as well. Put up, put up, put up. 
Ta-da! And then in here will be just I don't know wood. It does still kind of need to be proper brick road though, because we want wagons and stuff to be able to go over this without slowing down. Maybe like just right in the middle we'll have one, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, seven, eight, nine, nine, ten, ten. So we could have like bricks in here. Maybe we'll have bricks that long. Where'd the music go? <laughs> there it is. Thanks, music. Always there when I ask for you. Well, not always. Sometimes it disappears and leaves me hanging for like minutes at a time. No, we've used all of our stone bricks up. I mean, this is a very big stone brick construction, isn't it? I wonder if this could even go, like, here. We'll just go alongside the road. Okay. We're gonna need to wait a little while before we finish that. We'll just wait till our... Why are we paused? Why have I been paused all this time? Oh, I, I remember. I paused because I was messing around with this conveyor belt. That was silly of me. Well, it was silly of me to not unpause. <laughs> We're not going to get any bricks produced while we're paused. <laughs> I'm pretty sure our, like, our stone... Our stone supply is... Yeah, our stone supply is great. It's just a matter of this guy. This guy's probably working too slow, right? How many stones does he get in? Not enough to have that many workers in there. But we can fix that. Gotta like do some fancy conveyor belt work here, but there we go. <laughs> it looks like a bit of a mess, but it's gonna work. Stone. But now this guy will get more input of stone. Which hopefully means he can output stone quicker. Yeah. Seems like it's getting, like, stone just quickly enough. Seems fine. This guy is... <laughs> we could uh we could probably get another another line of stone coming in. We're gonna have to like do some do some more like conveyor belt rearranging around here because this whole system is a very old system which wasn't really made for such high throughput. So now that one goes directly there, but this one will... You know what? We even have room for another one to go like under this, which is nice. Um, but this will go like here. we got this kind of like unusable space down here anyway. Still too hilly to do anything with, so might as well just fill it with posts to hold up all of our conveyor belts. How's that looking? We're still mining stone quicker than we can output it.
and we're like pretty much oh we're just going up on that so that's fine we've got plenty of population space so i don't care if we're mining stone quicker than we can output okay what's going on here this thing needs more apples so the apple farm needs more workers also more apple trees but up but up but up oh yeah I, I'm pretty sure we can just plant apples ap like apple trees on every single tile that's in range of this forester which is excellent kind of why I picked this spot no no slopes that are too when you get to these slopes with the gray on them they're too steep but slopes that don't have gray on they're not too steep we need more workers in here let's get 10 workers let's get <laughs> let's get pumping these apples out look at that how many apples? <laughs> we're making 16 work units a second, which means we're making we're like, we're happening apples too fast for four conveyor belts. Um, we kind of only need to be making eight work units a second, because that will make four apples a second. Uh, actually, I think we need more than. I think we need two apples every second. That's what I want. Is that a steam booster in here? Get the steam. We can pop the steam from here, right? This this has plenty of steam. I think this has plenty of steam. If it doesn't, we can add more workers. Steam pie. Um, this just like go over here. <laughs> yes. Oops. Is that that's gonna that's not gonna interfere with this water thing, is it? Maybe. Put over here. Put like put, put up one. Put right over like this. I feel like that's gonna interfere with like something, isn't it? Put it up a couple more. Over here, and then then it can go down and in. There we go. Now we're getting steam in there. That will add an extra work unit. Um, is this guy outputting enough? It seems so. Yeah, his output's back to full. <laughs> Perfect. So this guy is getting his boost. He's got five workers. He's not getting enough sugar now, though. We can fix that. Let's plant all the sugar that we might need. We're gonna like super overproduce on sugar, I think, but <laughs> super overproduction is better than underproduction. 10 work units a second. That gives us what? Okay, we only need 8 work units a second. <laughs> Because then we'll get two sugar a second, which is the same as our two, as our, wait, how many apples are we making a second? We're making eight apples a second, two sugar a second, yeah, good. And hopefully we're getting enough coal in. We might actually be not getting in enough fuel, <laughs> which would be crazy. I'd need to bring in another conveyor belt of coal over somehow. Eh, it wouldn't be too hard. We just have to go like... Probably like double decker over the top of the one that we've got. Maybe next to it. I think next to it would be better. Because it goes at least here next to it. And then maybe here it could join double decker. Maybe even like come over here. Come in from a different angle. Might look cool to have like coal going under there and over there. 
But that's only if the fuel starts going down in here. Seems like fuel is good for now. And we're just like pumping out the jam now. Every now and then one's going to go into here, but like directly, I think. But most of them will come in here. We're, we haven't filled up on jam in here yet. So there's still room for more jam in these people's houses. Yeah, look, this guy's got all the jam. <laughs> they just, I feel like they're just like sticking their hand out the window and grabbing it off the conveyor belt. These guys could do that too, but they're not animals like the people who live in this house. Supply reinforced planks. Where is our nail guy? Okay, reinforced planks are somewhere around here. Are they in here too? They are. Okay, now you supply reinforced planks. Once we get all those, they'll be upgraded to this level. Level 5, the highest level. They will have their nice purple roofs. Like Isn't it beautiful? You gotta remember which number your house is because they all look identical. Like, especially if you live on this street, it would be so easy to accidentally walk into the wrong house, wouldn't it? Like, uh, did I pass six houses or did I pass five? How are we doing? Oh, sweet. Stone bricks are... fully ready. One more layer. I think two more layers. We'll put it on the same level as these ones. Yeah. Beautiful. Okay, so now what to connect these to there? I'm kind of thinking of like, I'll just do it straight. I'm gonna put like roads on top of these, but and I, obviously I'm gonna like support them underneath. But I just want to see what it, what this will look like. I look alright. That'll look alright. Okay, now time for all the supports. Boom. 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 We gotta make sure we get the middle bit as well before we do the this is the second edge. We are we good on that? I'd love like a fill button where you just like. You could just like select a bunch of blocks in 3D space and this save. Fill all of these blocks with uh with posts. Shit, look at that. We do have like some bits where we're missing missing bits on the inside. Right, yeah we are. We're missing in there. And over in there. You get in there though. <laughs> it's all right. Oh, there's some more missing bits in here. How did this happen? <laughs> I think I'm gonna need to do the other one in a different way. It's like we got way too many missing bits. The way I built this one. Tons of them. <laughs> Every time we want to like fill in one of these missing bit gaps. This 
What's that? Oh, I see. It was missing like two bits. I could only see that it was missing one, but that's one back there that's missing like tons of them probably. I think it's missing all the way up. Yeah. Because we couldn't get down to the, the level that it needed to be reached from, from the other side. I think I need to do it from this side. Do the middle one. Okay, there we go. I don't see any missing bits in there now. How's that look? Yeah, that looks kind of cool. I might even do like a little fancy fancy thing in here, like a little rounded bit. Some like benches or something. Auto save. <laughs> a little bit of lag. Uh oh. They heard they heard about the cool uh the cool bridge I'm making. The Popo is not happy. I don't have a license for making cool bridges. Just a renegade. But I have made I have played a lot of like <laughs> bridge constructors, so maybe that's uh good enough. I'm just gonna delete those because they're a bit in the way. They're not like fully in the way, but they're enough in the way that I'm willing to delete them. Accidentally deleted some behind. Blam, 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 blam. Okay, fixed. Blam, 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 blam. Blam. Oh, that's not it. <laughs> there we go. Blam, blam, blam. Blam, blam, blam. Blam, blam. Oh yeah. Yeah, I think it looks better with this thing like sticking out a bit. Maybe we'll even like No, I think um I think I want to do like hedge or something on there. I don't know. What would a hedge look like? Hedge wall? Oh what about what other walls are there? Wood walls, stone brick walls, frame stone walls. What if we just do like frame stone walls out here? Those look like kind of fancy. No, they look terrible. <laughs> what if... What if like this comes out a little bit extra too? Kind of like match with what's behind there, right behind what's over there, in in there, in the middle. <laughs> you know what I mean. Ooh, what if it like doesn't go all the way up? Maybe that would be cool. Um, and then, same over here. You could have like a, a wood bit on the side. It's like the footpath. The stairs going down to to your death. Not really sure about that. What about one of these walls? What if like wood wall? Can that go across there? Would that look dumb? 
a little bit dumb. What other cool structural blocks are there? Cheese blocks. Cheese blocks. Wooden blocks. Just do like full wooden blocks in there. Just keep like adding random things in and it will eventually look cool. Maybe that bit can be more like that, so it's like a buttress. Yeah, but. That looks alright. I think I'll do it like that. Um, the easiest way to do this, I think, will just be delete what's here. And... Rebuild. No, oh, I deleted one extra layer, I think. Yeah, I did. Very foolish of me. <laughs> Alright, we'll rebuild. These bits can just come in now because they don't need anything underneath them. And the wood wall. Good thing we got thousands of planks. <laughs> we can just go crazy with this stuff. Okay, so like use the the super duper. from above to make sure we get all of these in. We gotta start from the low end each time, right? And when you're using the view from above, there's no way to tell which bits you've missed and which bits you haven't, like, directly above. Well, I'm, I guess there's like a way to tell. <laughs> it's very difficult. That's what I'm trying to say. This bridge. <laughs> what a what a like thing of beauty it will be. Thing. <laughs> this is definitely the thing in this town which has had the most uh, effort put into it. I'd say. Okay, so now we can just like wait a second. <laughs> we can't go there yet. We need one one more layer of posts. good. I think we add some more like buttresses on the sides as well. This one can even go all the way out to here. 
fact, that can go out to there too. The side will be a little bit different, I guess. Just by virtue of being right on the edge of this cliff here. Realize I wasted a whole bunch of brick in there, but oh well. It's fine. There we go. That's nice. And let's just brick all that up. Oof. Beautiful. Okay. Okay. Road. Continue. Perfect. So it starts coming down here. Keep it three wide the whole way. Look at that. Oh, lovely. If we do need to do like conveyor belts down there, at least on that bit they can still have supports. That's not, that's not what we want. That's what we want. Oh, wait. Um, yeah, that's fine. Blam, blam, blam. Yeah, it's like they knew people would want to do three wide roads going to this. They've left the perfect gap in there. Or maybe, maybe that's just uh, some lucky happenstance. Um, we won't bother too much with the the inside bit that you can't see. Just need to keep this on the same level as the road at the Trade Center. Is that what it's called? Trade Center? Something like that. Trading, trading hut. Trading Mc, trades, Tradeston. Great trading trade minator. No, you don't you don't You don't get to do that. Just oh. Okay, he's put some like wood scaffold in to tell the road where it needs to be. Trying to do all kinds of silly things. Road. There you go. Ooh. It is one thirty. This might okay. I don't have work for a little bit. I've got like an hour left. An hour left to stream. Here we go. Beautiful. Now we can. Fuck me. This is the wrong trading post. <laughs> this is not the trading post I wanted to trade with. This is the one, isn't it? Bugger. Oh, Alright, well... God damn it. Um, we can't... We don't want to accidentally delete the trading post. Well, that's fine. That's perfectly fine. And in fact... It looks like we just want to stay at the high level here. Maybe even all the way along. Is that... Is that the same level as that? It is. Man. That's convenient. Oh, how good is that? How satisfying is that? Just watching this like whole road just like... <laughs> appear. This one, I think, is just going to be a bit of a, a bit of a boring old, uh, like, fill in the blanks one. We won't bother with anything too fancy. It's way out of town. Like the bridge is cool because it's, you know, it's on the edge of town. We'll be able to see it a lot. So I'm glad that the bridge looks cool. But out here, are we really going to see that that much? 
Maybe. Maybe a little bit. We're probably off in the distance, all blurry most of the time. Ah, oh, look at this! There's gold here too. We can uh, we can connect this gold up. Start start a gold mine out here. Maybe we'll start a new town out here. Since we got the road coming out here, we also need access. Um, is it enchanted books? Yeah, enchanted books are like the thing that we need to make. So it would be nice to be able to connect up to this enchanted book producer. We can also make health potions if we wanted them. I don't think we need them for anything. Maybe they're used for something. <laughs> to add remedies apple juice and mana mana crystals so it takes a remedy which is made of herbs so all you need is a bit of herbs water and apple juice and then add some add some magic and and you've got yourself a uh, a health potion What's this guy this is the recharging thing isn't it hmm What's that out there? Um, yeah, this is good. This is good having the bird come out here this way. Hmm. There are probably going to have to be some some like conveyor belts coming down this way, which makes sense. This is going to have a uh, fertilizer coming in. Why is this guy not working? Oh yeah. Uh, we need <laughs> we need to get these into here. I guess we need another kitchen up here. No, not a kitchen, a um, grain mill. just like stick some platforms on there stick some of this in here maybe even a little bit of that you know you know what goes well with a little bit of this that's right it's a little bit of that um, oh cool I was looking at it from this angle, I'm like, wait, isn't there meant to be a ramp here? <laughs> there is a ramp there. I just couldn't see it. Okay, you make animal feed. And then we'll, we'll pump it out from... Uh, we'll pump it out here and here. Will that work? Yep. Perfect. We're double pumping it out. So, and then we're double pumping into there, so that would be perfect. We might, we might need several, several green, green pump things. Uh, so we need farming tiles. Bum, 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 bum. Hmm. Man, all the flat tiles are used up by the road. Maybe we could put him down here instead. Okay, I've changed my mind. <laughs> You're not going to be there. I think it will look better to move it a bit away from the bridge anyway, because then we won't have those stupid... Um... We won't have, like, stupid conveyor belts. <laughs> like, looking all dumb next to it. What if we like stick it here? No, uh, that's not that flat. This area? No, not flat. There was this super flat area over here somewhere, right? Yeah, up here. That's ages away. And I wish you could just like I wish it didn't need to be perfectly flat to put put farm tiles on it. Hmm. What about this forest? Is this on a hill? Yeah, it's on a hill. Just 
reasonably flat. Yeah, I don't really want to ruin the view here. We got this nice forest looking at it to look out on. I think we'll leave leave this area looking a bit nicer. We're not we're not gonna like destroy everything there like we have in many other places. Where else could it go? There's some flat ground over here, but it's still like hilly. Maybe you could just like make your own ground or like Can we destroy blocks? <laughs> okay. I guess like um if you do it in like uh oh, in like custom mode instead of in a campaign, then you can uh you can mess around with the actual the actual terrain. Do some terraforming. That would be very handy to be able to do. Let's get rid of all these potatoes. Cut this grass so we can see what it looks like here. I think this is the best spot. We could even move the road further this way. Although that will mean it will have to like climb over that hill. I'll just go around it. You can like come out over here and then go... It'll look a bit weird. The road is a little bit in the way of, um... Can we just move all these columns? <laughs> we can move all of it at once. Okay, well that's... That's great. Yeah, we'll move it all over there. Hmm. Oh. I see. Uh, that wasn't part of the deal. That's fine. That... <laughs> it's okay. I can I can live with that. Let's put him like here, right in the middle of this fairly flat area. This flat enough area. What we'll call it. Area that the area that could have been flatter, but. It's fine. And this guy is like a crazy, crazy elevated road. But it does need to be elevated. Get over the, like this stuff over here, so might as well elevate it early. I do like having like a big. <laughs> Just a big straight road carving through the land. That gives that kind of like... It's very Roman, isn't it? It's that kind of like mastery over... Over nature kind of... Kind of feeling. Like we've 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 come in here, you know. We've seen all the disorder, all the chaos of the natural world, and we have uh, we have imposed order upon it. That's that's what a big straight road says. I guess we just go up the hill here. We rise up. Rise up against the uh, against the bourgeoisie. Okay, stand bourgeoisie, always keeping keeping the worker down. Oh wait, I'm keeping the workers down. Am, am I the bourgeoisie? All these people are working for me. I assume. No, they're working for each other. They are. Uh, they work for their um their society for the betterment of their 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 own town. I'm just like the mayor, making the decisions and executing those who disobey me. 
like any good mayor. Here we go. We we got a reasonable like valley of of farm tiles here. Looks a little bit messy. Oh, we could have like a little um little road coming down. What if we have like a little path, a little wooden wooden path coming down here, off the off the big road? I like it. It's like nice access. We'll like road all that up <laughs> a little bit. Quite the staircase, isn't it? But uh, it actually is nice because it makes this thing look a little bit less featureless. And it serves a purpose. We prick that? Nah. I think, uh, I think the path is nicer. Uh, you make grain. What's your problem now? Oh, no crops. I need that. Grain, 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 grain. We're only going to plant the grain on the bits which have the farm tiles. Even though you can plant it on the other bits. I like it better when it's on the farm tiles. And we're gonna have to like have double grain coming out here. <laughs> here I am, one worrying about whether it will look good, and then I just build conveyor belts right over the top of it. Uh, not that conveyor belts don't look great. I love you conveyor belts. You look um, amazing. Okay. I kind of probably want to do all my going down at once. So these, this needs to come to here. Which means it's probably like coming along along the water. Ooh, whoops. Oh no. how did that happen? Hell yeah, how carelessness. It's... Being careless can cost you. Cost you everything. You could be just like building a cool uh, a cool stilt thing and then bam. It's ruined. So it's, it's all ruined. There's no recovering from it. Or oh, maybe there is. Maybe it's like super easy to recover from. Like uh like like in this case. There are games where it's like you have to wait for your people to come and like build the thing that you've told them to build and stuff. I don't like those kind of management games as much, usually, just because it doesn't give you as much freedom to mess around with the design and, like, build it how you want it to look. Like, it makes it much more gameplay focused and less aesthetically focused. I'm, uh, I'm, a, I'm a person who likes the uh, aesthetics. As you can tell from my, uh, beer. 
<laughs> As you can tell from my beautiful town, I love aesthetics. I love the aesthetics of... <laughs> Look, it's ugly, in in one sense, but there's something very aesthetically pleasing about conveyor belts running around everywhere like crazy, especially when you get some nice looking ones. Like some of these are a bit ugly, yeah. But like when they're like going parallel to each other and stuff, like over here, these ones here look beautiful. It's just some of the ones in in here. We won't talk too much about them. I guess this is just gonna go along at this height the whole way. Wait, that's too high. Might as well, right? It's not like we're ever gonna run out of planks. Actually, I've only got 800 planks left. <laughs> Maybe we will run out of planks. But even if we do, it's only temporary. We have infinite planks, basically. We have as many planks as I can wait for. So we're only limited by my patience, which means we're very limited. <laughs> but I, th I feel like I have like a lot of patience for this game. I'm willing to just sit here and wait for stuff to happen just because it's fun to watch, watch all the stuff go on the conveyor belts. that all lined up yeah, oh yeah oh we've missed a we've missed a spot bam 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 nope wow we really missed this one i think i got it with the first pass and missed it with every other pass okay so now we do our little going up bit Here? Yeah, starting here. Now we need to get up to this level. It won't take very long. Uh, is that it? That seems like that will be it. Blam, 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 blam. Beautiful. And we need some. <laughs> big long conveyor belts. Big, beautiful conveyor belts. Here we go. Get in there. Get in there, grain. We'll be producing more grain here soon. That's what we're producing for now, but it, it will be improved. Um, I just need to go to the loo. I'll be right back. Wait, you know what? You can watch, you can watch the grain.
Come back. I mean, this will be starting to work now, so we're starting to get some milk in there, right? Right? Yeah, we must have, because we've got butter <laughs> in the output. Um, so we need another kitchen. Like, it's next door, I suppose. And this guy is going to make... Can this guy just make the stew? He can. We just need tomatoes. Where will we get our tomatoes from? Also, this guy needs fuel, which is very convenient because there's fuel right here. It's almost like I planned this. Hmm. We are going to have to go like across like this, I think. No, you don't grab butter. That'll be the one next door that grabs butter. This guy gets to grab the butter. You jealous? He's jealous. Oop. <laughs> that's not right. That's that's it. There we go. So now we get fuel and it will get um, butter. But it needs to also be getting fish. We could send the fish into a little tunnel through here. Fish tunnel. <laughs> Boom, 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 boom. What if we do it like that? E, 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 E. Oh, we can't, um... Uh, I don't think we can do a tunnel there, because there's, like, cliff underneath. Yeah, we can do a tunnel, we just have to do it lower. Which is fine, because that's, like... That's the level that the thingy is on. The thingy, you know. With the, with the stuff and the things, that's, that's, that's the thingy. There we go. <laughs> Me and my thingy. Um, sorry, sorry, Cole. You're being <laughs> there. So the fish can come out here. I guess we might as well pump it both ways for now. Pump it both ways. That sounds like a euphemism, doesn't it? <laughs> I'm pretty sure it's not, but maybe it is. Man, I love to pump it both ways. There we go. So the fish will be coming into everything except for the soup itself. Oh, and usefully, we can also pump... Uh, fertilizer from here into here and because we left like room under there it can just go like it can go a cool route we'll take it like this way and I love like I love getting a new a new system set up it's like yeah this will go here and that will go there and then like wham and then it starts working you're like Ooh, 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 ooh. Uh, it can't. Uh, it can't actually go under. Well, it can, but it will have. It would. It would have to go too low to go under, basically. So let's go over. Go over and then 
when we get over the other side, we'll like come line up with it. Like this. Oh yeah. This fertilizer delivery system is gonna be amazing. Fertilizer. Yeah. And look at that. It's like goes over there and like Like it could come No, I think I think like this is best because there's like an open spot there for it to go into. We do also need to get water in there somehow. Still. But that's uh it's a problem for the the distant future of of like a minute from now. <laughs> Far distant future. I wonder what the world will be like in the future when I'm when I'm getting water to that farm. <laughs> How will things have changed? Will I even know myself? Maybe. It would be a nice change. Do, 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 do. There we go. Beautiful. That can go a little like that. Now we just need these guys. Okay, so fertilizer's going in. Pardon me for the <laughs> nose blowing sounds. I want to blame. I want to blame the fact that it's spring. It's like hay fever season, right? But <laughs> pretty sure I've just always got a little like low level sneezles coming out. Look at that. This will go like parallel to these ones as well. We're gonna have like a, it's like a mega chain going up. Them all going next to each other. All these. These beautiful uh, conveyor belts living in perfect harmony together. Bum, 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 bum. This is all filled up with stuff too, it's gonna to be even better. Like this guy's not producing very much uh fertilizer because this guy's not producing very much grain, because this guy's not producing much grain. If we just like put ten workers in here. Should start really going. Yeah, look look at the grain going. That's coming out too fast. We can't pump it out that quick. 9, 10, 9, 10, 9, 10, 9, 10, 9, 10. What about now? 9, 10, 9, 10, 9, 10, 8, 9, 8, 9, 8, 9. Okay, we need 8 workers in there then. And there's never going to be any happiness boost here because it's too far away from the town center. Well, at least until unless we build another town center over here somewhere. So for now, there won't be a happiness boost there. But that could be in the future. We are going to need to get up here to get, like, uh, start extracting the gold as well. So. Good that we have our, our road coming through here already.
Yeah, that's like... Okay, we need to start going up. Like, just before we did. And then it would be pretty much perfect. Yeah, that's what I wanted. No, that's not what I want. That is perfect. Lovely. Um, I'm just gonna like get in this here now, for now, but uh, there will be some future time when it goes all the way out to here. Sometime not too far from now, right? Because surely the Apple Jam is just backed up to help. Yeah, look at, look at that. This Apple Jam is waiting. Kind of means we need to finish the road now. Maybe we need another big crazy bridge here. It's a long way to go. Alright, we'll, um... See, now it makes sense that it has to come up, because it has to come up to get there. And then, like, obviously it also has to come up to go over all the cliffs and stuff, but... <laughs> it makes it look like it just it has to come up to, to get to the gold, and then it can go back down again. just gonna do just standard old boring straight road through everything for, for here and in the future I might decide to change it and make it look nice hmm. no that's not what I wanted at all oh my god I mean, you really um oh. You really have to be very deliberate about your clicks on that, on the hotbar. What a satisfying sound it makes. The sound design in this game is great. Let's pop that there and there. Does that work? Oh yeah. A little bit of a little bit of a cheeky uh cheeky move there. Making it real easy to place my roads down. Are we out? We're, we're out of uh, stone brick again. I mean, we did just build, like, the Omega Road. Eh, it doesn't look too bad. It does, like, go down one lower here than it does here. But uh, I don't mind that. You don't really notice so much. Like, when we're only going to see this from over here. And, like, yeah, it's completely... It's all blurred out in the background there, so it doesn't really matter. Oh, shit, I need to... I need to go see. <laughs> I think we'll have time to uh, to get this all going. So obviously this needs more workers. And some upgrades. Earth crystals. Be nice to get those going. Ah, I see. This needs more people. More workers. Also that. Um, maybe we could also be pumping milk out to just like store somewhere. We could put milk in here. Or oh, butter. What's butter worth? Where do we sell butter? Sell it at the food market for 12 each. We could just be pumping butter out. That's like fairly valuable. 12. 
this way into the uh the warehouse first the warehouse the barn so we'll fill this barn up with uh with butter <laughs> yeah buttery barn yeah it's fine they can just go like that it's not like that last bit needs to be used that bit of road uh that's not it there we go, and blam. Uh, it won't have anywhere to go yet, but there we go, butter. Perfect. Why is this one getting fertilizer? I think I was thinking this would need fertilizer in it, but then I built that other barn for fertilizer instead. So, uh, and that might as well just be more apple jam. We're gonna... <laughs> we've got such a backlog of it. So much of it being produced. Might as well store 500 at a time. I think we'll be producing plenty of butter. Oh, there's something else that we will want to put in here. Oh yeah, we want to get the, um... Get the fish stew in there as well, and the fish stew will come out here. Fish stew. Fish stew. There we go. How do we get the fish stew in there? <laughs> Up here, we're gonna have to do a, some kind of like crazy, crazy conveyor belt. It's gonna start as high as it can. Is that as high as it can start? That's as high as it can start. Um, maybe I'll like, <laughs> maybe I'll even add a little bit of a ramp up here, just so that this place is accessible, even though it doesn't need to be. Makes it look nice. Like, it doesn't need to be accessible for gameplay reasons, but... For, like, aesthetic reasons, it's, it's... It's nice to have it accessible. Hmm. What if, like... What if we go, like, here? We can, like, cut into this a little bit, like we did with that one. Maybe. Cliff does come very close here, so uh, we could just, yeah, we can have like a little like lip. We'll have like a, a bit here where it comes out like this. Oh. I don't think a conveyor belt can go there because of that tiny little. Then we can't pull out from there. Damn. Okay. So it has to be like. Okay. So this bit here will just fill back up. Ooh, we could like, we could go like under here. Yeah. If I can like, 
I'm just gonna have to like temporarily remove the stuff on top to get down there. But what if like, what if we go like this? We could even go like that. I think I like a bit with stairs there, even like because it's not going to be accessible at all in here, since there's going to be a conveyor belt coming out here and going like up like that. But yeah, but it still might be able to look nice. Oh no, no, that's fine actually. If that if that doesn't work, we'll just do it like this. I think that's okay. Conveyor belt, will you work here? No area to really know it is there. We'll, um, help me. Okay, let's put that back in. This one will be completely inaccessible <laughs> if I need to, like, change anything. But, uh, let's just hope I don't need to change anything. It won't be completely inaccessible. I'll leave it, like, I'll leave it partially exposed down there, so... Phrasing. <laughs> there we go. So, like, you'll be able to see it all happening in there. That's kind of cool. Um, we got plenty of poo-poos coming out. Our milk production is... Just only being limited by animal feed. So let's take a worker out. Still being limited by animal feed. Oh yeah. Take another worker out. What's the problem with the... Oh, we've only got one worker in here. That's the problem. Okay, how quickly is this making animal feed now? Six... So it's making three a second. This needs two to make one of these, which means this can only really make one and a half a second. I could add a steam boost to this guy. I might just add an extra steam turbine over here. Steam turbine, steam engine, steam generator, that's the one. a steamy boy over here. Steam generator. Uh, <laughs> mm, looks alright like that. Boom, 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 boom. Wait, is it not? Oh, uh, it's not within range of the town center. So it's not going to be producing steam at like the optimal rate. <laughs> I think that's fine though. Does this guy need its own well? Maybe we'll give him its own well. Might as well. <laughs> Might as well. There we go. The water will go in there. Coal. Coal might have to come late. No. Coal's gonna have to come down from up here somehow. A separate way. We're going to have to do a bit of a switch back because there's no way I'll be able to get it to go low enough. It would be cool if there's like, like a chute that you could just drop stuff down or something. Or like... Blam, 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 blam. Let's 
can be, you know, mega coal, coal can be about here. Better boom. I think it will actually look kind of cool. Wait, did a uh, bit just get placed somewhere randomly? I can't see it anywhere. It made the placing placing sound, so no, hopefully it didn't. Hopefully it didn't randomly place a block that I didn't want it to place. Here we go. I like this because then we can we can also bring this off to other things that might be around here if, if necessary. Come on. There we go. Ooh. Ooh. There we go. Beautiful. And a splitter. So now we can get some peeps. Some some peepees. Peep peepee. Very mature. <laughs> and we wanna steam boost this guy. Well that's that's gonna be pretty straightforward. Steam connector, just put it like, I don't know like how high we're allowed to put it on here, hopefully that is allowed. Oh, we need to like go up and then get across. Wait, did I go up too many? I think I need to go up one. There we go. Now this guy gets his steam. And anything around here that needs a steam boost, we can easily steam boost. How's he going? Um, he's... He's producing enough now. That <laughs> It's the input that's slowing him down. Might as well pull some of the workers out. We've gone to all the effort of adding the steam booster. <laughs> we'll, we'll leave the steam booster in there. Four point eight work units a second. How's this going? This is actually filling up with animal feed. Oh wow. Okay. How about now? Still filling up? It is. <laughs> Well, we could pipe some of this animal feed around here and into like the wool and leather production if we're getting extra animal feed but that's a that's a <laughs> that's a project for tomorrow so that will, that will take a little bit of a little bit of wrangling of the conveyor belts What a beautiful town. What a like truly spectacular masterpiece. <laughs> Pipes and conveyor belts and just madness everywhere. I love it. We probably oh man. <laughs> just the honor. We probably don't need ten guys in here. No, it looks like um, looks like we're just full up on uh on metal. Suppose suppose we're not using it enough. What else can what else is made of metal that we can like upgrade the barn for? This one, sure. Use some of that metal. Got a big backlog. We got a no, not a big backlog. We got a yeah. I guess we do have a big backlog. Of, of like raw resources and stuff. Well, we, we've got a big surplus. We want to be using that surplus. It's great. I, I love watching like when it's actually flowing and you just got. Oh, lovely. We could get three of these in at once. 
to make this work even faster, because this definitely could be working faster. Yeah, so uh, that's, a, that's a thing for me to look at later. For now we need tomatoes. We need to grow tomatoes somewhere. Probably... We can, we can bring a conveyor belt through here. Connect them up, so we'll probably grow the tomatoes over here somewhere. Maybe here? Tomato farm. So let's use this. Um... E E E E what? Why is farm not here? Farm. Ah, oh, E E D gets us farm. <laughs> I don't recognize all the icons. Uh, it's there. That works. You are a tomato farm. Tomato. Do we do we want to put like uh, farm blocks under them? Will that make them work better? Yes. Okay. We also want to be bringing some poo poo and some water to them. Do I have time for this? Maybe. <laughs> Probably not, <laughs> but uh, I'm going to get started on it, yeah, at the very least. I, I owe it, I owe it, I owe these tomatoes that much. Maybe I do owe the tomatoes, because uh, I did, I did destroy a bunch of tomatoes. Ah, uh, other. Uh, okay, let's, let's take it up this way. It's like slightly less steep, maybe that will work. Or is it just as steep? It is just as steep. So we'll have to take it up just before there. Before it gets like ridiculously steep. There we go, that'll work. And the, the ground has like a little bit of like weird no, like, cleavage going on down here. It's like the butt crack of the earth. We found it. We finally found a way to literally fuck the earth. We've been trying to, we've been trying to do it for so long. We've been figuratively doing it, but now we can really do it. It's mankind's greatest achievement. Actually, this can go here. We're not going to use this, like, uh, crappy, hilly bit here. <laughs> I love that. It's like... No, let's, let's have some respect for the tomatoes. Put it in at this height, which is, I think, the highest height that it can actually go in at. I, I think that actually works all the way along. Brilliant. Okay. And we'll just do one next to that. For the water. Yeah. Yeah, we'll just do one right next to it for the water. Perfect. I have one minute left. <laughs> I need to go to get ready for work. Uh, this is not going to be happening, is it? All right, we're not going to finish it. The tomato farm will be ready to go, though. And that's, you know... That's pretty good. Oh, I see. Okay. Well, that's going to need to pop up here in order to go parallel with this the rest of the way. 
which I really want. That's what I want. What I really, really want. I want a parallel. Parallel. I want a really, really, really want a parallel convey belt. I think that's the words of the song. That was the original words which the uh, Spice Girls wrote, but the world wasn't ready for it, so their, uh, their agent uh, made them change it. I wonder if... Look, we'll put an item filter on this for fertilizer. Ah, oh, shit. It's time. So now... Wait, that won't actually help. <laughs> I don't want this to, like somehow managed to get onto here. But I suppose if this is always filled up, it won't. Oh. Maybe if that's like that. No, it can't be like that. Well, hopefully it doesn't somehow end up on there. If fertilizer ends up on there, then we'll be big sad. It's like Fill in some like farm tiles in here. Blamo, blamo, blamo. Look, we can have like upper field and lower field. <laughs> I'm not gonna bother with like perfect, perfect kind of like uh, building, <laughs> just because I don't think we need it. I don't think we need it for the the old tomato farm. We're not going to have that many tomatoes growing. I want this one here. It's not on the field tile. We've got more that aren't on like bits where there's no field tile. Bits where there's no tomato. There we go. Build it all in. <laughs> What's the time? Oh shit. <laughs> now I'm over time. We're into overtime here. Yeah? Stoppage time, as they, as it's sometimes cool. I think stoppage time is a great term. It's like, yeah, we needed some extra time to stop. We couldn't, we couldn't quite stop in time, so to enter stoppage time. I like the idea of having like a little bit of a platform going around here. Maybe this will like hook up to. I don't know. We'll just hook up over here for now. Maybe something else can go up up there. We are like developing a little town around here. I like this. Like you build a few little things in a spot, and it's like, oh, a town is starting to develop here. Maybe I'll build a town center here because we can have like this cool town. Or maybe when this is full level town center will extend all the way out. Probably not. <laughs> We've only got two more levels to get in this. Yeah, so I think only two more levels of town center are available to us. All right, well, when we come back, look, you know what I'll do? I'll put a sign up. Finish, don't mark to. Soup. There. So when I come back, I'll see the sign. <laughs> it will tell me what I need to do. But, yeah, but, but now uh, I need to go. I need to go get ready for work. Um, so, thank you for watching. Have a lovely rest of your day and all night. And I'll see you next time.